Tsushima wins.
There we go. Yeah, there we go. All right. Oh, perfect. Oh, I did mess with the volume setting though. It might be way too loud. I don't know. It doesn't seem like it's. Turn it down. Turn it down a little, cause it seems like it's peaking. I turned though, it down all the way. That's fine. Yeah, cause it's still see, it's still like picking it up pretty okay, hard. Okay. All right. Hopefully we're not uh, too loud here. Yeah, I was gonna say I can't tell if it's uh, his laptop might get loud. It's it'll be this. No, it'll be that. Cause uh, I remember Chris had this. Okay. Yeah, yeah. 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 Sick. All right. So we got Byleth Lucas. What do you think about this? Uh, I don't know. I feel like Mayor is going to be very oppressive against uh, Lucas, especially when like approaching, because he doesn't have like the fastest out of shield options. I think Lucas is definitely going to have a hard time approaching in this matchup, but I also feel like Lucas might be one of the few characters in this game that can uh, mess with Bios recovery a little bit. Oh, that's very true. Yeah, PK Freeze is off stage. He's got that multi-hit down air. The yep. back air comes out like pretty that. quick. PK Thunder. The PK Thunder, of course. <laughs> yeah. Oh, 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 actually gets him there. Okay, so hey, 90% down, Byleth definitely has a lot of kill power. This is kill percent, but Lucas can string together some stuff. Mm -hmm. Let's see if he can make out of this. Gotta watch out for the up air here. Gets, ooh, yeah, especially if the, the Byleth is hitting those uh, tippers as well. Oh yeah. He's gonna do a lot more knockback. You know, I learned recently, uh, if, well, I, I might have told you this already, if Byleth gets to do, ooh, well, never mind. Wow, that'll do it. Forget about what I learned. <laughs> doesn't matter if you get a tipper smash. or not. Get out of my face. <laughs> that down smash is more than enough. Oh, that would have killed like probably 40% ago. <laughs> oh yeah, down smash from about so strong. Oh, very. They buffed that move too recently. Yeah, they made it faster. It's just crazy. Absolutely nuts. Because I, I thought given given the amount like the amount of knockback and damage it does, I thought the speed was all right. But then they're like, no, let's make it faster. Almost <laughs> instantly breaks shields too. It's just it's one hell of a move. Exactly. See, I was gonna say if Bylus gets uh, the tipper on that forward smash and gets some charge on it, it's actually stronger than their down B. Oh wow. Which is crazy, but this is another yeah crazy move that Bio has. But doesn't matter as long as you, if you hit those down smashes, you don't need to get tippers on anything. Mm -hmm. All right, starting game two here, I believe. Yeah. So, oh, that that's gonna be really good in neutral too. Cause I don't uh, Lucas can't absorb that arrow, correct? He can't absorb it, but he can reflect it with his forward smash. Oh right, yeah, the, he has the bats. But timing like that can be a little bit tricky, so I don't know if going for that would be the uh, the safest option. Mm -hmm. Man, that forward air is just so good. Yeah. So like so safe. You Very can good space at walling out. Exactly. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> it's hard to get in on Byleth, man. Yeah. This character, I mean, everyone thought this character was complete garbage, and then Leo started beating everyone with Byleth, and yeah, and I'm like, all right, let, let me try Byleth again. Let, let me see what's up. <laughs> I, I still think they're not quite as good as everyone makes them out to be. I, I think there's a little bit of Leo propaganda. I definitely agree. But he, you know, he showed us some sauce. The character's got some sauce. Yeah. The, the main issue is like Byleth's speed. Oh, and in, that up smash game, is crazy. In a game with so many fast characters, you're just gonna get like outsped by all of them. And, Absolutely. Like, get like destroyed neutral. But hey, Byleth doesn't even necessarily need to approach too much, right? It's a that's, little not as bad because they're, they're trying to stay away from you. Well, that's that's it too because then when they try to like stay away, you know, they don't need the speed as much because they have the reach of the, right. of the forward air and all right. that. Absolutely. They can get pressured though. Not kind of stinky out of shield except for the nair. Uh, they're a little, they're a little, they crumble a little bit under pressure yeah. once you get past that tipper point. Yeah. All right, so up 41% extra credit so far, up one stock. Yeah, Bio's looking pretty good here. Oh, that up air up is air. so nasty. So disjointed, so strong, yep. kills so early. Another move that kills pretty early that I don't see too many uh, Bio's go for. That back air did just kill at 80 as well. Great ledge trap in there. Mm -hmm. Making it just a nightmare to get off the ledge. Ooh, misses the wow. PK Thunder edge guard. Gets back too. Oh, there you but go. But that force will definitely kill. Great catch on the air dodge for sure. All right, let's see what the move is here. He's down a whole stock, but... It's not impossible. Yeah, Lucas can definitely steal some stocks. Yeah. 84% yeah, like, after gimping, nine neutral yeah, wins. Gimping Byleth isn't, isn't impossible. I, I've seen it happen quite a few times. Oh, yeah. If you get them horizontally far away from the stage, that tether starts being a lot less useful. Yep. Vertically, it goes, I think, longer than any other tether in the game. I think it's the longest I, I tether. I think so, yeah. But the, the, that's the downfall of a lot of tether grabs is as you start to go horizontally away it gets a lot harder which pk freeze real good at for example yep <laughs> all right i guess the pk fire we got a ledge trap situation oh kind of just gets back up for free i feel like that's one of the places lucas can really start to take control of this matchup i think boss a little limited off the ledge yep slow slow aerials 
Ooh, actually gets oh. him with the oh, but misses the rocket. Doesn't get the rocket though. I don't think that would have killed because although it looks very strong, it doesn't do as much damage as you as you think. It is a lot weaker than Ness's. Yeah. That Nair dash attack, by the way, from Bioleth never looks like it should work, but it always I know. works. I know. I I'm surprised people aren't prepared to tech it because like I see Leo go for it like every single game. And that up smash is like, not I going to kill. Uh, Solid I, I was, DI. I was saying though earlier, like no one goes for up smash, but it's a really good move. It it, it picks you up pretty easily and it. Mm -hmm. uh, do you know what? You know what frame that? Oh, oh nice wow. stage spike does not tech there. it. Do you know what frame that up smash is by chance? What frame? No, I do. No, I, I don't either. It seems like a pretty. It'd be pretty quick out of shield though. Yeah. Ooh. Oh, wow, that's, that's so okay. good. That Off really the untechable spike. Just like that. Three Q takes it two zero. Yes, sir. Really showing us the power of that bio. Yeah, that was really good. Am I gonna get called out in chat? Let's go. Yeah, dude. Yeah, Josh had really good space in the whole game. Josh is actually running it back on stream, so let me update things. Because he is playing Diddy Dang. Oh, overpowered bananas followed. Oh, um, do you want to do that right now? Yeah, um... Okay, Elgato capture is not showing sound. So. Okay. So fix this. Where is? Oh, oh, oh! We got sound. We got sound. Let's turn this up a bit. Elgato Capture said there's sound. Yo, Josh, move around to the menu and you can check the sound. Click a stage, click a stage, and then go back. Okay, yeah, it works, okay. Uh, people in chat, let me know how the audio is for the game. We, Diddy Dank likes to use headphones. So we use an audio splitter and we routed the audio through the uh, Elgato. Wait, it's still coming through the TV too, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Sick. Okay, wait, let's go. If the need be, I can turn down this limiter a bit. Um, anyone else want to join me on stream? No, everyone's playing their games? That's good. That's what we want to see. Everyone playing their games. Two, one. We got Bowser versus Byleth. We got some thick boys, some heavy hitters. Byleth is pretty thick, not gonna lie. So, 5% uh, from random, I think that was a Nair or Fire Breath, and 1% from another Nair. This is very little damage considering how, how high damage these characters are. And 
Okay, that's phase because they're not going to be able to punish too well. Oh, runs up shield. Gets beat out by the back air there. Phyla's forward air and back air. Very good disjoints. Very strong. Very good sweet spots. A lot of range. Okay, up tilt. Okay. Catching the landing there. Oh, that was a good shield punish there. Oh, cancel that. I feel like he kind of wanted to shield damage there, but that was really cool. Ooh, both going on low. How's your off stage? It's kind of scary. Oh! Ah, he baits the shield option and then goes for the forward smash. That was pretty nasty. And full on drop kicked out here. Okay, good forward air follow up. Oh my god, Danner's through the platform. Doesn't get anything else off of it though, unfortunately. Trades with a forward tilt. That was pretty silly looking. He goes for Nair. Nair's not going to kill there, but it does get more percent. That said, Bowser is pretty high rage right now. Okay, forward tilt still not going to kill. Bowser is really heavy. And we're just seeing him get back to the ledge safely here. Good jab. Oh, good shield punch there. Oh, goes for down smash. Reed. Forward air for it. He goes for a hard roll there, Reed. He gets punished. But he's going to get some percent with that up air. Pretty even game right now. Uh, Violet can make percent up pretty quickly, uh, but does have to play a pretty spacing game. Whereas Bowser, if he gets in, can do a lot more damage. A dash attack, getting more percent lead. Oh, good jab. Really good get off the option. Bowser just takes up so much space at ledge. Okay, up air. Doesn't get the second one. He gets the back air punish on that landing. Oh, he runs through him. That was really interesting. Bowser bomb. Down tilt. And he's super dead, yeah. I don't think there's much that could have helped him there. Pilot has a good recovery, but there's a point where you're just off stage enough. Maybe if he had air dodged in. Ooh, off shield, uh, off ledge option. That forward's special. 1.9% uh, from the fire breath there. Every percent matters. Oh, Clank? Okay. Oh, the roll read does not quite connect. It's a big Bowser bomb. That up air not going to do enough. That up air needs to be close to the blast and actually kill, so. Okay, back air. That's Moss Sage. He's going to go too low for that arrow. Oh, he tries to go for the side smash there. Gets the tipper on shield, but doesn't quite get anything off of it. Oh, drops on fair. Yep, that's going to take the first game. So, Diddy Dank is up 1-0. That's a Q, not a 1. There we go. Position. This is actually winners round 2. Because Diddy Dank got a buy. Oh, we got a new follow from Ash Gren. Ash is Gren. Nice. Thank you for the follow. Welcome to our stream. We happen pretty much every week. Uh, Smash content. These are the, the people who are willing to play on stream. So feel free to... They're, they're willing to be getting mutilated. And we're switching to Pikachu for game two. Maybe uh, Diddy Dank wants to warm up his secondary or uh, thinks this is a better matchup. He wants to be a more dominant game two. Maybe sniffing out some adaptation from Josh's or three Q's end. Yo, thanks, man. Um, right now it's looking like a very. S oh, I don't think that side smash was side special is intentional, but it makes it back safely because Pikachu can do anything he wants. Pikachu lives in his own realm of doing what he wants off stage. Jabs. Oh, ducks under the arrow. Ah, uh, the pancake moment. Thunder Jolt's gonna hit him off stage. Get some extra percent, but he makes it back safely. We're seeing like a 50% lead on Pikachu right now. That said, Pikachu has to work a lot harder for a kill than Byleth does. Um, I think we're seeing Byleth kind of struggle to hit Pikachu here with how thin he is. 
tanky. Oh, does he get anything on that tech chase situation? Up smash out of shield. That does a lot of damage. Ah, uh, lots of respect on shield here. Both respecting on shield options. Okay, back to ledge. Violet is fortunately at uh, above 100%, so certain ledge trap options will now work better on him. Oh, gets the last hit in that landing nair. And back throw? That is going to take it. I don't know if that was bad DI or if that move was just going to kill because of that town and city. Oh, dang, that forward air takes it. Evening it back up. And as you can see, we are on hazards on. And this Smashville, it is moving. Schmoving. With that platform going up and down. Daring someone to get killed really early. Like Diddy Dank, who's sitting on there. Holy. That was a good string for 3Q here. Dash attack. Man. Oh, tries to go for the down air. Oh, initial night. Okay. Oh, are we seeing the. No. Okay. Not gonna. Oh my god, that down air sour spot's gonna take it. Uh, s stunning comeback from Diddy Dank there after being down like 60%. Oh, and Pikachu is clicking all the moves. That was a good string. Only to 30% though, so character diff between damage per hit. That's a very small shield. I'm trying to. S I'm wondering if we're gonna see another hit on shield or if Diddy Dank is wary to it. Okay, forward tilt. Well, yeah, we have Pikachu's in the lead. He can safely run away in Thunder Jolt. Oh, tries to go for a down smash. That was kind of sus, but maybe he knew something we didn't. Oh, grabs the forward air? What? That was some crazy reaction speed. Being able to grab that move is really not easy. Oh, we see the Thunder trade with the side special there, and it's going to take Pikachu stock. That move is really strong. Uh, big Lance do damage. And we're just seeing them kind of space around each other. Violet is down 75%. That said, we saw him do 60% with one string earlier, so he could easily make this back if something crazy happens. And no one's going to pop the balloon. Potentially avoids popping the balloon, I see. I was really not safe to there. But alas, on commentary, we have something to. Oh, he tried to go for a downer on the puppy. That was very risky, but he got Pikachu able to get away with it, how fast he is. Pikachu has some really weird hurt box extension during his up special, so. Oh no! Aaronhar trades with a Thunder Jolt, extending his hit lag, and that's gonna take him to stock. And Diddy Dank Team Skate takes set. <laughs> yeah, and our, our lovely players making comments about how sus that hitbox was. Who's on screen next? Okay, we're gonna have Nakano and Sly on the stream. I'm back. Let's transition to this while we update stuff. Um.
I was trying to see where he's working out from. Okay, Sly and Nakano, or Nakano. Sly, let's go. I taught this guy everything he knows. Oh, nice. Cheering for our boys. Well, he's in winner's round two, so. Do you guys need tags? Uh, let me update the numbers. Name right, score right. There we go. Should be two oh. Zero. There we go. We're making some names. Nakano, pray for your boy. Oh, oh, yo, we got some. We got some uh, competition going on between our chat members here. Oh, I really need to implement a, a betting system for channel points. I know a lot of uh, Smash streams do that, where they host bets for who wins the next match with channel points. We need some some actual reps for our, our boys in game. There we go. Updated to scores. You can see everything up there. Um, we are working on an updated banner, so. Um, the white text issue you see right now should be fixed next week. Um, also, members in chat, let me know how the sound and audio is because we are we switched to an manual audio input uh, as opposed to HDMI for the Elgato. So it might be a little bit different sound base wise. And classic, trying to see if their name's on the switch and realizing it still is. <laughs> Josh, you're gonna join me on stream, pal? Yep. What do we got in chat? Uh, dude, we got reps for both of these players. Yeah, we got Diddy Dang. Uh, Ash Gren, Ash, no, not even Diddy Dang, bro. We got Yo. Uh, Sly and Nakano uh, cheers in chat. So. What a rivalry going on here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Anyway, yeah. Those are like two of our close games. Oh, yeah, against City Dank? Yeah. <laughs> oh, yo, what's up? Our stat, our hazard on for every. If the rule set is on, it's all hazard on. Okay, so. Okay. So we don't like switch hazard on and off for the stand. No. Run, okay. Yeah, because uh, the only two stages that actually have hazards are Town and City and uh, The King's rival can't be a peasant. Ah, uh, I see. Got two gentlemen appreciating each other's rivals. I'm telling you, I'm a bias main now. Are we going to go to timeout on rock, paper, scissors? <laughs> A king's rival can't be a peasant. Yo, that's some like Mordekaiser shit if y'all play League. This ain't no esports, so I'm swearing on my fucking stream. <laughs> it's not even my stream though. <laughs> <laughs> you still ban us, dude? Yo, can I swear on your stream? It's not esports. Pardon? Can I swear on your stream? It's not esports. What'd you say? Shit and fuck. Well, you said it again, so there you go. It's fine. Just like, don't go cussing out someone. Don't do anything that would get you canceled on Twitter. Okay. Yeah, but like the things that get you canceled on Twitter are so random. I don't even know what the hell they are most of the time. <laughs> so we got Roy. I don't know who the other guy plays. We got Roy. Cash money, Roy. Pretty fucking. How dare he swears? Yeah, exactly. Bro, I don't see you in bracket. Pull up, bro. <laughs> I'm joking. I'm joking. Hey, we're both in losers bracket now, so. Nakano is carried carried by swords. Yeah. Roy is carried by the sword. The bonding blade is so OP in Fire Emblem Six. Literally the only reason why Roy is. Josh, do you want to do you want to talk about your recent enlightenment? To not playing Roy this week? Yeah, I'm a Byleth main now, I swear to god. Yeah. Right, well, next play, let's go. Get more people coming. Get them. Grow, this, grow the weeklies. It's, it's, very, it's, 
Ah, uh, and you see, not only do we have our players playing the game, we still have two, 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 two play next round. Next week, washed or get washed? Yeah, bro. No, yeah, come, you come. Get Rotom so. washed. Yo, I see his. Oh shit. Oh yo. Oh, this is gonna be insane. Is this Swoopert? No, this isn't Swoopert. Wait, so there's two. So used to come to the old weeklies, and he has returned. Um, did he always play Ices? I think he did. Yeah. Yo, that's sick. That's sick. He recognized me, and I totally blanked on who he was. I felt so bad. So. I, okay, I Ices. This character is a fucking menace. I swear to God, this like this Steve. And um, Sora, they're all menace characters. Okay. Well, the thing is, right? If you've been home alone doing nothing but la being icies, I like am You're quaking in fear. Just saying. Yeah, yeah. Like, come on. Oh, he's hitting back the ice. I've seen icy since pre min, min online. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So they like this. This is like pre -min some min, yeah. some 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 rare footage we have this right here. This is a really interesting matchup because I feel like Roy gets super comboed by icies. I just feel like he has a lot of options to get them off of him, so... Yeah, I have no, I have no idea. I've never played against this character before oh, in my life. Here? Okay. Oh, um, he's not... Okay, not off stage, unfortunately. Spike's not gonna take it. Yeah, that's dead. Oh, that up smash is gonna take it with two hits. Yeah, the smashes are... Roy loses pressure okay. from character size alone. Lol. <laughs> so my favorite game when watching Ices is to guess who has higher percent. Uh, it's always... Nana or the other one? It's always Nana. Oh, okay. Unfortunately, it loses Nana right as he falls off stage there. Yeah, the AI is an actual burger. I don't know what the fuck they're doing when they program this when they program Nana. Bro, Nana's like way better than she was in previous iterations though. It's not much yeah, of a that was kind of a weird up a side B, but maybe I need to go that high. Well you you mash to go higher. Oh no no okay, not an air dodge back to Nah, she knows how to air dodge at least. At least she knows how to air dodge, bro. Oh dude, did you see that air dodge from Nana? Yeah, she's moving though, she's smooth. There's a lot of side specials going around here. That was a lot of shield stun, holy. Actually, I would imagine you'd have to... Oh, is Nana dead? Nana... No, wow. It separates them. I have them. no idea if what Nana's doing is like what he's inputting, or if it's just like her own deal. It's usually her own deal, man. Wait, yeah, you... what? Nana fall off legend? Look at that four there? What? They can just mash something and they'll do something. Okay. Oh, we can't punch that. As long as still, as long as he's still kind of even, like a... Uh, this side B converts an upper. Upper is a huge combo. Ooh, that's, oh, that's yeah. Popo's okay. gonna die. Popo oh. is alive and oh. on stage. Okay. This is now sword character versus smaller sword character. Sopo, Sopo do everything. Dude, Sopo's gonna sauce. That's him. dead. Oh no. Yeah, what? good DI there. See, I'm sorry. I don't know what good DI looks <laughs> like. I can't DI. Okay. Yeah, that one. Okay. That's gonna kill. Yep. Very nasty. Frame four armor on that. I'll be at a shield. That's 21 percent. I don't know why. The upper's really strong now. I they Dude, well, it hits twice, bro. Well, yeah. It's two upairs at the same time. It's like it's like a Mario combo for free. I mean, Rosalina upair is really strong. Oh, bro, Rosa too. That's another. Realistically, though, it's not Rose upair. It's uh, Luma. The upair, Luma. That's another menace character. That's that's a pretty loud. It's getting way these high up bees, but I don't know how much that it's killed from cross stage. Oh, that's the high side bees. Yeah. Okay, side let's B. On both of them. This could be like one combo to death. Yeah. But side B is an extremely. Guys, climbers do have a lot of ground. Oh, what the? The decent catching the fucking shield there. Oh, oh yeah, he went for that. That was intentional decent. I'm pretty that, sure. But that, that, that was yeah. yeah. I'm pretty sure. That was pretty sick. He might have died actually. Off Another of that. up B had a shield. This up B is putting in a lot of work in the combo right now. Yeah, it's pretty hard for. Um, Okay, he gets the last hit there. It's very hard if to hit uh, Roy's shield, especially. Nana just races. runs away. Did you see that? Yeah, she's kind of throwing. Yep, and it's dead. Oh, he saves! He saves Nana. Let's go. Oh, nice save. Yeah, I'm gonna drift back so he gets both. Oh no! Uh, I mean, unfortunate. Is that supposed to be an I think he was trying. Yeah, he's trying to drift back so he can make sure to get Nana there. There was some very interesting stuff going on in game one, uh, but Nakano is gonna take it. Roy is our boy around these households, and Fire does beat Ice. So, that's sad. We might see some adaptation from Sly come in, or some crazy Ice Hammer stuff come out in the game too. We almost saw a crazy, uh, decent combo there, but I didn't quite get the finisher. They are staring longingly at the counter pick screen, <laughs> looking at stage options. Who's your favorite to win right now? Hmm. Well, the chart says. 
it's the matchup chart says. The matchup. I actually. I, I only know matchup charts and nothing else about this game. I actually know nothing about this matchup. This matchup is whack. Bro, I feel like Icy's like wins or loses any matchup depending on like how cracked the player is. That's true. Are we gentlemen to Venom? Please no. Can't say probably. Oh no, actually, no time. Oh, Going to Vanilla Battlefield. Okay, okay, okay. You've heard of Chocolate Battlefield. Now get ready for. Vanilla Battlefield. This matchup seems rough for both. Weirdly, yeah. Is Sly gonna carry kind of thing? Roy gets Omega. Like Roy, Roy being the fast, being a fast faller. Um, I just realized our boy Nakano is on Pro Controller. He's just vibing, standing up with his controller in hand. He's got the H box gonna, energy, bro. Just stand up. Reboot. He's got no cord attached, dude. Yeah, the. No cords attached. Oh, I think Sly was changing his music. Bass. Uh, music counter pick? Always kind of bass. Oh, he's got the headphones in. He is gaming. He's here to win. Is it midterm stuff this week? I have midterms this week. Oh, okay, you yeah. Had. <laughs> yeah, MSAF, that shit, bro. That was, that was a hard MSAF. But my, my poor study habits aside. What classes were they for? <laughs> Out of curiosity. Uh, signals and systems and stats. Signal beam? Signal beam? Yeah, dude, my favorite. And it's actually charge beam, not signal beam. There has to be a signal. There's a signal beam, right? We're seeing a lot more usage of that down special from Icy's here as a way of punishing uh, shield. There's good damage, good shield pressure as oh, well. Oh, we're seeing okay. Yeah. Yo, that double forward air on shield does so much damage. Those desyncs are all oh, real- Oh, he goes out of his way to get Nana off stage, but doesn't get anything off of it. Nana's not gonna live, die. So those desyncs are all really, really hard as well. They're and all Nana, like- you can see how much more percent Nana has because she goes way higher from that up, up D. That all backer kills both of them at the same time. Ah, oh, just Roy things. Just Roy things, man. He was so strong. Oh, oh he ate the jump. jump. Yeah. Okay. That was a uh, really good edge guard from Ice Time. Is recognizing that he wants to double jump from ledge. Yeah, I, okay. I, that's that's what I have. That's the what sort of have. Spaces aside, these really interesting. Look at the freeze status out there. I never Ooh, understand how. Oh, Jeff smash, Jeff smash. Uh, freeze. No, Nana! Nana throws. Nana dies. Yeah. At 69% nonetheless. Yeah, it's looking rough for Sopo here. That yep. hit below ledge. You saw that, right? It had two frames. Does that move, um... And, ah, uh, yes. Roy yells um, at them and they die. Roy's, Roy's neutral beacon uh, can two frame. It's just a pain in the ass to hit. Just Roy things. Okay, gets the freeze status off. Bro, you're down smash. Like, like 500 frames to ledge. Yeah, it also doesn't hit behind me like most down smashes do. Yeah, it does. It only barely hits behind me if you're like inside of Lucas. At the last hit. I've seen some egregious things. Jeff smash again. Jeff smash. <laughs> Jab I to our homies named Jeff in chat. It's Jab F smash. Is Cactus Donda here? Um. Unfortunately. Oh, he saves. He was, saves Nana! That was really Yo, smart. let's go! That was really smart. That was so smart. One good conversion can even this game Dude, back these up. these ice climbers are more like rescue rangers. Let's go. <laughs> okay. Can have One some big side damage. Beat. Yep. Nothing else. Up B. It's only Nana, really. Uh, we are seeing a lot of Roy swinging at... Well, I wouldn't... I would say Ghost, but there are actually two of them, so... <laughs> Oh, that would have killed. Oh, oh roll behind forwards. That's no, dead. it's not a cool this jump. Oh my nice, god, he steals nice. the game. What an insane. There's a lot of unfortunate edge yards that's that game. You got a 1-1 one, 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 one scenario here. Maybe you got a 1-1. One, one. Uh, I just want to say, Sly so had to beat Arif to get to this position. And this is only like round two. Jeez, bro. So, there's, this could be another... I wasn't sure where to seed him because I hadn't seen him in a while, so we might have underseeded him, and there might be some huge upseed sets right now. Sheesh. I'm not still throwing. <laughs> Is that your tea? I don't know. Yeah, we are drinking some tea. Because tea is good. And I need that shit to stay alive.
I don't think that was throwing. That was just kind of an unfortunate offseason situation for him. A bit of a society but moment. Yeah, no. Hano is really good. I played him uh, a couple weeks ago. Mm hmm. He me on stream, so. Very, very dangerous character. So we are gonna. I don't, I don't, I don't see what stage they picked. I love playing on stream because it means that everyone can see my. Like, I yeah, swear he's a demon. No, no, Akano is a demon, bro. He's been showing up. Ice climbers. And here we are, game three on small battlefield. Not really too much of a counter pick here, but. That's a good stage for Roy. It is a good stage for Roy. Roy doesn't really like bad stages, though. Although, considering as. Slide pick battlefield might be very comfortable in stage as well. I wonder if slide ban town. Oh, yeah. slide, dude, that was the smart. ice physics getting away from that up B there at a shield. Yeah, that was really smart. You have actually so much drift and on the. Uh, that was a lot of shield damage. Yep. Surprised I didn't poke. Yoshi's story is not in our rule set. It's we gentlemen's only right banned now. that shit. I hate that stage. Oh. I wonder if he, Town of City was banned, because Town of City is like Roy's like actual best stage. Maybe he banned Town of City. Yeah, that's a smart, that's always a good um, thing to ban against Sorties. We were playing with Hazards on this week, so we have um, Northern, Ca uh, okay, wait, what are Sorties? We have both Battlefields, we have Smashville, we have the new Sora stage. And FD. And FD, yes. And then the counter picks are the Sephiroth stage, Northern Cavern, Northern Cave, and Town of City. Yes. Um, we have mentioned though, this is our first week running with hazards on, there's a lot of, uh, gentleman suggestions for people who want a gentleman to, um, a counter pick that is not on our official rule set right now. One of them being, so Well, you Kalos can't run Kalos on the hazards on. Yeah, so if we switch back to hazards off, then we'll have PS2, li well, no Lilac, because Lilac sucks yeah, either Lilac, way. Yeah, Lilac, even without hazards, Lilac's pretty sus. It's too fucking dark, man. Okay, that's not the issue, bro. It is for Are me, bro. The, the stage tilts? Well, okay, yeah, but I can't. I literally can't see on that stage. I'm a whiny Smash player, and I don't. I want to actually see what I'm swinging at. I can see clearly now. It's I, pastel colored. I, I, I was literally legally blind in one eye for like two years of my life until I got surgery. My lot is B A S in design. No poke. What's P K? Pokemon Stadium. Going for the cola. Oh, oh. Lilac's bad in design, okay, I see. Going for the cola. Double backers off stage. Of course, okay. I know. Damage. That's gonna oh, kill. Oh, that was a good follow up on that freeze. Nice little setup. Looking like so. So, yeah, that, that, the way the uh, freeze works is that when you're in freeze, you take no knockback or very, limo, very minimal knockback uh, and half damage from attacks. But because they use. Ah, uh, no jump. Oh, he can't save Nana. Yeah, if he had a jump, he would have Nana. Dude, you can't run Pokemon Stadium on Hazard Zone, though. The same melee. Gets decent. He's dead. Oh my god! He's dead. Yo! He got the clip! Let's go! Somebody clip that. Somebody, Somebody clip actually that. fucking clip that. Yeah, that, that was, was so good. Legit decent combo right there. Man, it's cracked. Pokemon Stadium 2? No, dude. You cannot Pokemon Stadium 2 with hazards on. No. You know what the transitions are for that? It's so cursed. That was an insane finish to that set. Okay. I need to I need to wash room. I hope I hope someone clips that. Holy! I'll be back. Yo yo yo! Does someone does someone want to clip that? That was a good uh, that was a good uh, beat thing combo, man. Dude, that was so good. Yeah, that was really good. What if Demi, the Diddy Dank, and I are probably gonna play on stream? Okay, okay. Diddy Dank and. Um, Romentos. Yo, Ashes Grind, are you gonna clip that? Please clip that. Yo, yo, who 
always be on commentary. I need to go play my game. You guys know how to pick the score, right? Yep. Okay. Oh, let's go. I think we have winners semifinals coming up. Uh, I th think so. This might be winner's semis, yeah. Yeah, I think it's, it's winner's yeah, winner semis. semis yeah. Winner's semis. We've got Captain Peru and Brick on the mic right yes, now. Yes, sir. You know what it is. Captain Peru, know. fresh off of going 02. Happens, happens. Sometimes you got That's a rough rhyme. Bracket. Oh, it does rhyme. What do you know? Yeah. Yeah, yeah we got uh, Bromentos and Diddy Dank coming up for winner's semis here. It's uh, probably, you know, they both play a couple characters, but probably we're looking at Cloud versus Bowser. Unless, unless, you know, he, he starts off with the Pikachu testing waters. Yeah. And Diddy plays a little bit of Pikachu. And whatnot, uh, but I, I think we'll be seeing the Bowser game one. Bromentos plays a little bit of Byleth. Think he'll pull out the Byleth? Nah, nah, no, 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 no shot. You don't no think shot. it's... Uh, not, in, not in winter semis. Fair There's enough. too much on the line. These, these players have played each other okay. too often. So who do you think, if you're Cloud here, who do you want? You want... I mean, I would assume you want Bowser, right? Oh, you definitely want Bowser. You don't want Pikachu. Pikachu is a T-jolt away from ending your entire recovery. <laughs> Correct. Meanwhile, Bowser, at least, you know, you can scrap with him. You can trade blows. You're both... Got pretty fair. meaty hitboxes. That's totally fair. I mean, Diddy thinks Bowser nasty, though. So we'll Let's have to go. see how this yes, shakes out. Yep, yeah, Cloud Bowser, as expected. Getting into game one here. We Should we uh, update that there header? Yep. So I think it's it's, it's wrong. On, it's uh, The names are right on the left. Score is wrong. And then everything's wrong on the right. Yeah, we'll change all of that. So while you're doing that, we're getting into the first game here. Just some solid, some solid nukes right now. I feel like Bowser... Uh, Cloud's got a big sword, keep people out, but Bowser's forward air. Might as well be a sword normal anyway. Ooh, whiffs the limit blade beam there, but that's fine. Cloud does get that back fairly quickly. I feel like uh, this is one of the few matches, too, where Bowser doesn't quite have the kill power differential he normally has. Cloud's not the strongest character in the game by any means, but he can definitely uh, take some stocks really early with some back airs, up smashes. Uh, anything to do with limit as well, you know. That's true. All those moves kill. Yeah. Definitely a touch earlier than you'd be used to on a character with the ground speed that Cloud has. Speaking of killing early, though, we are on battlefield, so some Bowser side B cheese could very much be in the future here. He's got limit. This is a dangerous spot for Bowser. He's in disadvantage above him on the platform, and, and there it be is. It. Yeah, taking him out. Limit cross slash. It may be weaker than Roy's side B, but it's, uh, it's a lot safer. It's a job done at 150, even it, if your name is Bowser. Oh, yeah. King Koopa. Heaviest now, character in the game, but not quite heavy enough. Let's see how much damage he can pile on before this stock expires. He's still got a, a fair good way to go, I think, before Bowser can take this. Ooh. And, and that commentary is quick. It's how it goes. Had to waste his limit on the up B there. It's kind of a shame, considering it was pretty close to ledge, but... 44% extra credit. It's not nothing. You love to see Clouds wasting the limit up B off stage when you're fighting against them in the matchup. Oh, yeah. All right. So 76% um, up here. I mean, I'm just going to say. Back with the flame breath. 30%. Play Bowser oh. can make up those percents real quick. Oh, yeah. But so can Cloud with that up B out of shield. So reliable. Yep. Just you got you to space your moves properly. Misses the side B, but hey, it's basically lagless, so does not get punished off that on limit. Limit side B is uh, completely lagless. Completely lagless. Pretty much just lagless. Crazy. Oh, wow. Going for the high recovery there. Interesting yeah. mix-up, but Misses not getting punished. But he, well, he hit him with the last few hits of exactly. the up B, so it caught him out. Flame Breath. Flame Breath. Such a great oh, option for just... Especially against Cloud Recovery. Yeah. Those recoveries that go a little bit past the ledge all the time because they're yep. hitbox, and, and that's going to do it. platform, that'll do it. That's some... Some suspicious DI perhaps as well. He kind of went straight up there, but he was dead. But at that percent, I think he was dead. Top was battlefield dead platform. But uh, did he kind of make it off like a bandit here with that stock? He started off down seventy percent and it's managed true. to take and it first. But oh my God, Bromentos! The curse is strong today, and that was also just a great down air. Getting the spike, taking thirty from. Let's just you know. It's it's flame breath. It's how it goes. You're gonna take thirty if you don't take forty. But uh, oh, getting a nice combo together here. Yep, Bromentos the side B. back. With 62%, and it's not over yet. All right. Okay. Let's see what they can do here. So, Bowser. Oh, oh wow. The grab off the side platform. Going to bring him to the top. But the dunk. Oh, thank goodness he's on stage. Or else that would have cost him a lot. No, nope. the momentum's definitely in Bromentos' favor oh, here. Oh, yeah. Missed the up smash just barely. Sending him a disadvantage. He's got the limit. He's at 130. This is exactly where Cloud wants to be. And, and yep, that'll do it for game correct. one. Catches him with the side B there. All right, so that's game one going to Bromentos. Really back and forth that game. Exactly kind of what you'd expect. Bowser and Cloud are both just kind of run up in each other's face, start throwing hands. Oh, yeah. But one thing I got to point out is uh, Bromentos has been doing a fantastic job of tracking that Bowser recovery. I think all oh, three absolutely. stocks 
was off of an offstage interaction. Two of them with the limit side B and, and then one, one with the, the down air. Yeah. You're correct. He's Absolutely been, he's correct. Been, uh, Bowser, while having a really good recovery, isn't good against disjoints because, mm-hmm. you know, it's a it's he's a moving hitbox, but oh yeah, if you can just outspace that hitbox, he's got nothing really yeah, to do. Yeah, but he's got nothing. So Cloud using his advantage right now. Oh yeah, that's something. I mean, he's got one of the biggest swords in the game. This cloud's, this cloud's kind of clean with it. This cloud is very clean with it. Trust me, Romentos is. Uh, he's he's crazy. Yeah, that he, he, you know. Friendly with him all the time, man. He's wild. He's changed my mind about Cloud. Cloud's a little better than I used he's to think got he was. Fearless in my head. All right, so getting into game two here, Town and City with uh, so yeah with we do have hazards on. Middle platform, on. yeah. Correct. So middle platform moving up and down, side platforms coming in and out at a bit more uh, usual of a pace than they normally do. I hope we see some wacky Town and City stuff today, man. I don't. I hate the yeah. stage with hazards <laughs> on. I ban the stage. This I love it when people just grab each other off like the moving platform and then get like a free back throw kill at 40. True, it can Those make my for favorite some clips. Entertaining clips. Oh, uh, ooh, gonna hit him with the F tilt, send him super far off stage. And, and okay, he makes it back. Troubles. How's he getting off the ledge? He's not. He's not. Well, back oh, into a ledge drop situation. Oh! Once again, just so good at catching out that God Bowser up the. Damn, he said stay down there. Oh, yeah. He said stay on Your stage. edge guard no is now place. my edge guard. You reach, I teach. Correct. Oh, oh. interrupts the sub B there, but he's fine. He makes it back. Just a little bit of a scare. That might kill. No. Nope. Oh, Town City just wide enough for him to stay alive there. Nice stall with the side B. And gonna make it back safely. Let's see if he can get off the ledge. No, that, that fade back F tilt, the Diddy Dank special. So good. So good. Such a lingering F tilt too, and it's strong all the way through. Oh yeah. Oh, Worldly that, Fortress versus uh, you know, Side B. Who's is better? Just a battle of wills there, seeing who wanted to spam their move. Uh, Real DBZ moment. Oh yeah. Beam struggle. Oh, oh going over go. the flame. That was good. That was some. Yeah. So, that was a solid. Jumping solid. right over and reading the shield too. What is this so far? This is like a 50% punish for hitting yeah, this the has B been button. Like a 60% strength. Oh, oh, what? Falls oh, out of the wow. be there. A little bit of tough guy, maybe a little bit of SDI. That, you know what? Tough guy. Probably SDI for sure, but tough guy probably is the reason he completely fell Ooh, out there. Gets the downer and just barely misses that back air punish. All right, what's the what's the edge guard here? Oh, gets oh, footstool. Footstool, footstool. All right. And the side B. Wow, That's, with the rage, that almost killed. Did you see that? that? He was so close to the top left. Though. And Town City, highest legal ceiling, I think so. That's just insane. That's wild. One more of those, and he might be able to do it. Ooh, oh, I, I, just barely. I'm not sure about this DI coming out for Bementos. I could be wrong, but he, it feels like he's going way more vertical than I usually see that Bowser side B. It is also Bowser with Rage, so, you know, got to take that into effect. But the limit side B will be enough to send him out of here. Team Rocket is blasting off again. Game two. Uh, this, is, this is game two. Who has it first? Uh, Bementos. And Cloud. Uh, Cloud. And this is uh, best of three, best yeah, of five? Yeah, best of three. Best so of three like still, he, yeah. He's at 97% and he has limit. He's, he's one touch away to, from to close taking the out. set from the regular weekly winner, Diddy Dank himself. Oh, yeah. Knocking him into losers. Oh, oh, gets him with the last hit. Wow. And that'll do it. A little bit of a pop-off there. So clean 2-0 from Levine. Just so good with from the clouds. Going crazy with it. Diddy Dank putting up a very solid fight, but just... Couldn't really figure out those offstage interactions. Got caught a couple too many times. On that yeah, movie. all his recoveries were kind of just getting intercepted there. He was never being able to like come back on stage for free. And the one time he went off stage to challenge it, he got punished for it. So listen, hindsight's twenty twenty. But maybe if these guys meet in grands, uh, the Pikachu might be coming out. I have a oh, suspicion. If I know Diddy Dang, he's he's gonna crawl his way back to grands because he doesn't take the loss kindly. Oh no, Loser, losers bracket is not happy about this. No, losers bracket is crying right now. All right, now I gotta go play this cloud, so this will that'll be fun. Yeah, might as well get on uh, the yeah, cloud. Not me. Not you? No. Not me. I don't play the one. No, not yet. Right, right. 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 If, I, if, I, if, I, if I win this. No, Chris, I need a bit. I need a bit. <laughs> All right, let's go. Go on stream? If you want. If you don't go want. On stream, go on stream. Go on stream. It's winter yeah, man. Yeah, I like cloud, yeah. I need to go my shit, though. That's why I like stream, too, is you get bottom. Nice job, man. Thank you. Black, man. You play that, like, just mm, immaculately. Thank you so much. Especially the offstage game. Do you remember the icy stag?
squad, man. <laughs> Instrumental Panda, you should show up and play Min Min against these guys. You, you get a lot of good matchups. Stay away from this little I got this compared to last time just because I caught his jumps like on his way back to stage mm. I was like yeah this helps so much <laughs> There's a little bit of Min Min hate in the chat uh, Listen, but, but yeah. I hate Min Min too but I think you shouldn't hate the player for playing Min Min because no. just the character just the character and the matchup and, and, and your life doesn't play Smash, admittedly. She plays ARMS. She plays ARMS in Smash. Whoa. Oh, ARMS oh. music, though? Banger. I'm glad we got that shit. I don't know about that. Ooh, what? I love that stuff. Nah, dude, Ribbon Ring sucks. Rib I can't stand Ribbon Ring. Is that the... Da -da -da -da. Whoa. I love that. Whoa. 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 Min Min resident sleeper. I agree. I agree. Pardon? Min Min, Min, Min Min resident sleeper. I couldn't agree more. I like watching uh, the buzzes Min Min, not gonna lie. Admit her OST is sick. Is that Ribbon Ring? Or no, that's Ramen Bowl, right? It's probably Ramen Bowl. Ramen Bowl, yeah. I don't remember how that one goes. I'm not gonna lie. But uh, if I had to trade Min Min for her OST, I would do that in a heartbeat. Never mind. Proto Banham's Min Min. Goes hard. I gotta watch this set because I'm playing the winner of this too, right? All right you want, watch it while you stream. Oh, what the heck? I'm yeah. dumb. <laughs> I was like, hold on, I can't do this by myself. Third truth? <laughs> I'd honestly rather the Icy's win, but I want Adam to win, you know? <laughs> because I think I'll have a better time against Icy's yeah. than Kazuya. You're exposing yourself on the stream, just letting you know. I know, I know. Well, right, he right. said this about me last week. True, 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 true. He true, true. popped off when I lost to an incident report. I know, I know, I know, I know. I know. <laughs> right? So well, it's like. But you want to expose the matchup knowledge? Oh, the, yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, yeah, for the I, I definitely think I could split the Icy's apart. Yeah. Take it, edge guard them, you know. I mean, Icy is just pathetic range. Like oh, you, yeah. you, I feel like you eat their lunch. I think Icy sucks, but Sly is making it work, and I think he's really good at gimping with uh, neutral B. Yeah. And he's doing incredible decings out of nowhere. Dude, that last stock was crazy. Winners, winners finals. Hey, did this say winners finals? No, no, no this, this is winners finals. Semis. Oh, you're in winners finals. Oh, let's go. Let's say. Well, I'm joining the O and two gang, so. Sad. Uh, my last game, I messed up my recovery just a little bit and got destroyed by the bottom of the stage. And I was like, huh. Huh. So. Just pure pain. Lucas just does his thing where he bounces off the bottom of some stages, he doesn't grab legs and just cry. So. You don't get your recovery back? Uh, I tried the first time and it didn't work because the battle stage is like weird. Oh, look at this expert stream, man. He's crazy! Yes, sir. My boys. Winner semis plural? Winner semis Ugh. apostrophe? How does it's this. Semis, S -E -M -I -S. Uh, S -E -M -I -S. Okay. Yeah. That makes way more sense. Nobody owns the semi. Honestly, I'd be down to face either Dude, of these I people, wish but still. I the semi. There's a semi truck and they just get all the stupid setup here. There's yeah. a Kazuya? Fear. Yeah, I know. Fear. By a semi -truck. Bro, what is this matchup? Kazuya versus Icy's. This is gonna be. Never so seen before. Do you think. My money's on. I, I feel like Icy's. Eats Kazuya. They're both super close range characters. I feel like what happens is Kazuya, Icy's are hella degenerate. So Kazuya's gonna get an electric on one of them and it's gonna extend the, her, the hitbox and hit both of them. Yeah, I but don't like, know. He, he's still not gonna be able to carry both I, of them in the combo. I feel though. like Kazuya struggles to separate the Icy's. Oh, yeah. I think this is. There's a lot of high base math back, right? we'll I think see. it's gonna be a super hard matchup. I think matchup. it's more like Kazuya's gonna struggle to get in against this wall of hitboxes. Oh, no. Oh, no, no. He knows how to save mana, man. You've saved so many Nanas today. Save your nons. I love nons. 
Man. I'm so scared. I didn't know there was a, a top level oh, ICC. Did we live those? Oh, he lives. He lives. He lives. He lives and, and Nana's still, still alive. Let's go. Oh, and he still lives those, too. Good, uh, good DI. I get so much height off these uh, side beats. I just don't. Don't know if if you mash, yeah, off. if you mash side B, you get a little height oh, off it. No, oh, there goes Nana. Nice. Okay, so so, -po. Po. so, -po. so -po versus the demon Kazuya himself. Dude, I bet you his Sopo goes crazy. His Sopo must go crazy. Oh, oh, oh never mind. Yeah. <laughs> his Sopo might have gone crazy. Sopo might have gone crazy, though, still. I, think, I still think so. Side B is uh, hit the move into whatever the heck you want. Okay. Also, oh, oh, wow. He's going to be up to He mashes out really good. Kazuya, rage drive, rage drive Kazuya. online, yeah, but which, but which icy is he gonna get? Yeah, wait, like, you when he grab goes, one of them. Yep. Yeah. Oh, but it's gone anyways. So okay, we'll, we'll never know. Okay. Much like how wing works, Kazuya's rage drive just kind of like dips whenever it feels like it. Oh, good back here. Okay, there we stops. go. He Only 30% extra credit. Like that just ruins Icy's desync as well, yeah. which is uh, awesome. This combo is still going. This is 112. This disadvantage is lasting. Okay, finally sit down and get out of that. Yeah, you no really got to avoid either. Blizzard. I think you just got to camp out Blizzard, honestly. Wait, he lost his second rage right yep. too. Yeah. Holy. Kazi's only done 20% this stock. Take that in. He's I mean, only 20%? You really got to consider control. that Icy's have the damage output to Smash negate. Kazuya, yeah. yeah, to negate Kazuya's uh, rage drive too, right? Well, Rage oh, Drive has, has all the no, armor. He doesn't get the, he doesn't get the it doesn't. Oh no, I mean like taking yeah. away Rage Drive. Oh from yeah, 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 yeah. He gets he gets them past one because super easily. I I see. Yeah. Oh, they got good damage laser? output. I'm when they're to together. Them separate, but it's not okay, out. trying to separate them. Gonna get the Sopo. upbeat. Oh, uh, Nana's too far away. From it just me. seems like it's really overwhelming for Kazi to manage. It's well, it's, it's really even, hard. Even stocks right now, and like Kazi can kill people. Up. Any That's also really true. Stuff. Yeah, but he's at 100%, and Ice okay, Climbers hit kind of kind of hard. Will he be able to keep it though? Finally, he gets a raise drive on. He only grabs mana. Yeah, but it lands on Popo though for 30%. So you wait, know, we don't we take wait, those. He landed on. He landed on the Popo. The landing does 30. The landing usually does more than 30. That was the weak landing box. He got lucky. Hello. Yeah. This character's so Kazi dumb. Kazi doesn't pay his taxes. But okay. it looks like Ice Climbers doesn't either, or at least the way Sly's well, playing Ice Climbers him. only pays taxes for one character. And there's the F Smash. Woo! Wow. And Yo, Ice Climbers got that um, marriage tax evasion, so... Yeah. Dude, I'm telling you, it's as I expected. Pardon? I feel like Kazi has struggles with this matchup. That's I, game one. I think it's Ice Climbers' Holy favorite. That was a game. Yeah, the setup's I lagging a little bit. I don't know if it's the internet or like if you're on power saving mode or something. No, it's plugged in. Yeah, it, it do be a little laggy, right? Yeah. Is it plugged? Uh, it's plugged in? Plugged in the back? Oh, I don't have anything else. I can close Discord that might help it. What is this warning? Skipped frames. Yeah, so oh, it's, the stream's lagging a bit too. Okay, I'll have to check that on the replay. Also, I kept hearing sus, uh, sus the eye on commentary. I held in on every Bowser <laughs> or Bowser side. That's side yeah. So sus the eye on all of them. Awful the eye. Awful the eye on every single one. I didn't. I held in on every single You know, as long as you don't one. get grabbed at kill percent, doesn't your di doesn't matter. I, I realized my di every single time after I got launched. I'm like, what am I doing? I hope that Twitch stream didn't mess up too much. <laughs> I'll have to watch the replay. Um, oh, let me update the score. Yeah, yeah. All right. Starting off, game two, final destination. A great stage for both of, these both of these yeah. characters. Both of these characters, that's the thing. They're they, so dangerous. No platform shenanigans. They just want to scrap. And oh boy, do they scrap. Yeah, they're, they're going to bring each other from side to side of the stage. Corner carries for days. Bro, one thing I don't think we talked about. Uh, this is so much shield damage on Kazuya Oh, three. hell yeah. Blizzard. Big lag. Okay, we'll have to blame the Master Wi-Fi for that. Big lag. Yeah, we'll, wow. we'll do some... We'll try to do some maintenance after this game, but... Yeah, it we'll might just be the Wi-Fi. 
And uh, Kazuya can't seem to get in with... You know what? He keeps seeming to break out of this ice earlier than I think he's supposed to. And I think it's because he gets like hit by the full thing as opposed to like the, just the freezing pits. I also think uh, Sly is his name. Oh, yeah, Sly is definitely that. anticipating his dashes, his invincible dashes, and just acting right out of it. Oh, no, oh not anticipating that one, though. No. Yeah. yeah, who can anticipate that? <laughs> A spot dodge that kills at 80. Yep. I love spot dodges. Especially ones that I kill, too. Looking for the electric here. Let's see if he gets anything off it. And no, see, the Nair split them apart, but not getting the strong hit on either of them to continue that combo. Yeah. Icy's sucks for this character. The low tier counter. One frame for 10 seconds. He's oh, baby. Oh, How long is it going on for? Oh, gets the electric. Gonna find the upbeat too and the kill. Wait, the yep. Oh, of course. Uppy yeah. is yeah, hella strong. Seems good now. And. Nice all right, and Icy's now on their last stock. Kazuya only at 40%. Oh, that landing forward, it was really... Rick definitely trying to take this to a game three, and seems like he's on his way. He's so getting good damage. Here's the question. If it goes to game three, who has the advantage here? Oh, man. That's, that's a good a, question. That's a slime I have some cooking. I mean, Kazuya we, wants... We've some nasty zero to deaths or, like, high percent yeah. combos from him. We haven't even seen him bust out a major decent combo this, uh, really, this stock yet. The, oh, or this, this match. game, this, this match, match, I should say. Yeah, like, that's what I mean. Previously so, uh... Rick's time could come. Oh, and they're oh, gonna find the kill. Oh, oh nice. no, wait, he's not dead. Dude, he lives. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You heavy, heavy guy. I mean, in terms of bands, Kazuya wants FD as much as Icy's do. You know? Oh, yeah. Oh, he gets hit by Nana. Not gonna die for it yet, though. Oh, but they're finally. Yeah, gets... Ice climbers tend to fuck up combo, combo characters. characters. Oh, yeah, agreed. No, he breaks. Nana story. will be fine. Nana will be okay. Nana will be okay. Unless. Bro, Unless so that F Unless, yeah, there we so go. Menacing. Good right. stuff from Brick. Like, Such an uphill battle. Man, but uh, it seems like Brick's just trying to fish for a kill here, right off now. I mean, yeah, you just you don't have to you don't have to respect the. And that seems to be it. Yeah. We're gonna go for game three. Once you're against the Sopo, up 110 percent, you just start throwing out your kill options. Now I don't he think I wanna. Do I don't think I wanna face either of them. Stream is good now. Yeah, but no, uh, just uh, I'm so unfamiliar with ICs. You just keep them, keep them at arm's length, arm's distance. That's true. Yeah, arm's I mean. length, dude. That's not an arm. That's like that's a that's, that's a like solid two meter sword. Two that's meters. Like a rake worth of yeah, just, just slamming them with a rake. <laughs> Get out. Stay back. <laughs> I warned you. I Me won't fighting lose. off my raccoons at Stay 5 a.m. in the morning. Deliberating over the stage pick. Very hard right now. <laughs> In other news, let's take a look at bracket. So Yeah, how's loser bracket going? I'm not sure. Loser bracket right now. We have Nakano and Roots playing. Um, I'm not exactly sure what this set's going, but the winner of that is going to play Diddy Dang. So that's a really scary match. Going yeah, do you even want to win at that point? Ooh. Hello, Nana. Nah, nah, nah. You want to at least get like top five. No, obviously. I'm kidding. But like, it's a very scary person to be seeing in your losers round four. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I mean, this is a two time first place and winner. And we're still here. waiting on the result of Freak Q and Aerith, and the winner is going to play Day Knight. Ooh, I really like the reach in that match. Day Knight's kind sword. of the sorty killer, right? That's a really early match. Oh, it just one of the matches presented, yeah. Well, it's like, yeah, Inkling is not. Oh, what did I say? What did I say? I predicted it. I called yeah, it. So Chat. I don't hurt. 3Q in a reef? Oh, man. What did I say? Inkling. He's good against Sorry. I called it. I'm a fortune teller. Yeah, yeah. Well, Josh has also been playing uh, Violet this week, and that's not much harder. I heard about really? that. Really? Yeah. Oh. Diddy Dank was telling me he pulled Violet against him. Yeah, so uh, uh, he's a Roy player. Yeah. And he's been finding that he's too carried by Roy. So he wanted to slow it down to play a character that's not as broken. No, and his Roy is so good. But it's been really good for his neutral, so... Oh, and they've picked Smashville, it seems? After all that deliberation, they go Smashville. This, is definitely, moving, moving. this is definitely better than Kaz. Yeah. You think so? Some. I think so. I know I know personally that Brick is a huge fan of the stage, even if it is like and good for Kaz. Yeah. moving now. It's even oh. better for Kaz, yeah, I think. I, yeah, but again, I don't think he's a big, too comfortable on this stage. Oh, okay. Generally, yeah. yeah, yeah. Even if it's like a good character yeah. stage. But we'll definitely, we'll see how also, this shakes also, down. Also, side note, uh, balloon pop count. Oh, balloon pop count? Balloon pop. Oh, oh my god, that was 63, 63 just to like start. Just to start. Moves. Oh, it was 
this. Misses Are the electric. One broken damage here? Oh no. So many characters in this game. Freaky one, are you sure? What? I don't think so, because Inkling one over there. Yeah. Saw Inkling over yeah, I think a reef one. Just updated, oh man. I'm confused. Well, good tech on that top platformer. I'll see what he's eating a lot of damage. Kazi a glowing red with the rage drive. If he grabs Popo here, that's a stock, but percent is piling on. This is just kill percent for both of them. I don't think it really matters what percent for at this point. Oh, gets oh, mana. 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 No mana. And, and I gets Popo, Popo right with the dragon goes fist. one, two. Wow. Oh. It's so funny to see the move that's supposed to be a cutscene and not be a cutscene against mana. That's so silly. My goodness. That was oh. crazy. He gets the game, but doesn't get anything off of it. Oh, tries to read the roll, but barely misses it. Oh, dude, he's trying to sauce mana. Oh, but gets the forward air. I okay, mean, okay. 8 only 8% so extra credit. Not bad. Nakano is trying to learn some other characters too. Joker and Lucina. Yeah, uh, apparently he pulled out the Joker today in he bracket. He played Joker against me, and I only lost because I SD'd. Oh. But his Joker wasn't bad. John's no. I know he pulled out the Lucina against me two weeks ago. That was yeah. That was pretty. That's pretty. That's pretty John's on my part. But <laughs> I, I was like up sixty percent on my stock. No, I was up 60 percent, and then I died to ledge shenanigans with uh, the thunder bouncing. Oh. And then here we go. Kazuya trying to get back to stage here. He gets oh, the electric. wakes up electric. Ooh, just barely out of the range oh, for up smash to work. Nana not will make it back. back. The AI knowing how to recover there. But they're rare sight. Super separated. Very late punish. This is still like even percent basically. Any character gonna die. Oh. Yeah, but it. And it looks I like it's gonna be Kazuya. Smash. Okay, Kazuya's got some deficit to make up here. Oh no. Oh, no. Ooh, oh, that could have okay. been crazy. That's a really good air dodge out. He was very scared of that uh, forward air there. Dude, Nana just ran right past Kazuya. Didn't care. Oh, oh there goes the Dragon Nana. Fist. Gonna take out Nana. Okay, is Sopo gonna get some extra credit here, or is he just gonna blow up? You cannot punish It'll definitely him. make it hard okay, for him to get some extra credit. Extra credit yeah. Okay, more. Tries to attack Trace, okay. but... Wow, just Dude. spacing these forward airs. Playing Popo like a sortie he is. Dude. Oh, wow, the we're, we're not gonna see a Sopo kill, are we? Dude, there's no, no chance. No way Sopo takes no the chance, stock. Right? No way. No shot. Not at this oh, point. Oh, the snipe. That final stock, stock. final game. 60%. I kept him in the game there. Uh, that's just extra rage drive percent for Kazuya, honestly. Yeah, but still, gonna have to oh, get Icy's up in the percent percent. window first before rage okay. drive becomes effective. And that shield damage from down B, I mean. So, yeah, Kazuya has pretty poor added shield options, so that shield damage is really big. Sly kind of just running it here, outspacing all of Kazi's approaches, not letting him get anything started. But he's glowing red now. He's got that 1.1 times damage and knockback. Or Popo gonna blow up? This is a real question. Looking to take out one of them. He's gonna want to find. I think Popo. Dude, there we go. Popo, That's a game! Oh my god! Oh my god! Goodness! He takes out both. Dude, he set. ran right past wow. Nana. Found Popo. Killed him at 66. Oh, you're you are not hiding from me. Wow. These hands have your name yeah. on them. That was what good. a what an what a that photo was finish. The most hype seven seal what a photo that was finish. Good. What a finish. I mean, that was a photo finish if I've ever seen one. That was wild. And Nakano beats Roots. Oh, let's go. Actually, that was just Roots saying hi. He didn't head out. No, I mean, come on in for you too, man. I don't want to get talking. Close match, man. Close match. Yeah, you got you got robbed on that. You got robbed in that last interaction. Yeah, it was. I thought he was gonna grab Nana for sure, and then just teleported right past and got Popo. We normally fuck grabbers, but he has like invincibility. It's difficult to counter. And Diddy Dank on stream. Why not winners finals? Because winners finals can wait. We lose this bracket to catch up. That's fair. Because I think they're gonna they were gonna play right now anyway. So. So, we're gonna get uh, loser semis on stream first. Yeah, fair enough. Let loser bracket check up a little bit.
That's fair. <laughs> oh. Sly Sopo is low key better than his dual climber. It felt that way. I was so scared Dude, I was going to get Sopo killed. You're getting rinsed for that yeah, little bit. Gonna be by Sopo. I did not I, want to. I, I really thought, after he took the second stock, I was like, oh man. Dude, when he read my roll and F smashed me, I was like, okay, that's it. I'm going to lose. I'm going to get two yeah. stocked by Sopo. No, I'm just going to sit back. Not Luckily, Rage Drive is complete nonsense, and he died at 56 for making one mistake. It was 60 something. It was 56. No, it was, more than, it was more than 60. It was like 90 after he got hit, but. It was, he was at like 61 or 62 or something. Maybe. Nah, because that move doesn't kill him. Uh, he DI'd it wrong. Even, even still. It w oh, no, it totally does. If you DI it wrong on your ICs, you totally died ar earlier than 56. That move's nonsense. Uh, you want to move Diddy Dank's vein over a bit? Oh, yeah. So we got what? Yeah, is it gonna, Diddy Dank and Nakano? The banner situation a bit. So, oh, no, he clicked the wrong thing. Yee. 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 Uh, yeah, it's not. That's no, no, just click on the name thing. And that's then a better idea. Name, name left, left, yeah. So we got probably Bowser versus Roy here, it looks like. Be very careful. You're clicking the, yeah, move. Four. No? Okay, wait, let me do this. He's doing brain surgery. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Roll all. Why don't you have a mouse, eh? The touchpad, I feel like, doesn't have the precision needed for this. Yeah, Bowser Roy. I'm godlike. Going into game uh, one of losers semis. Barely. Okay, but it's gonna be it's, oh, it's gonna be it's gonna be overhanging either way. Yeah. yeah. So. Ignore well, the uh, well, winner well, semis at the top there. Loser semis, right? It is loser semis. If he went for a grab instead of bear, he could have so me. Oh yeah, he could have. All right. So getting into it here. Is it quarters? Okay, this is quarters. Sorry. Oh, losers quarters. Never mind. So we got. I honestly. Diddy Dank and Nakano. I think I, t I might, uh, like, uh, Roy's, Roy's crazy. I don't think this is too bad for Bowser. I think Bowser has Bowser, some... Bowser, like, I think all of his matches are the same. It's a matter of how hard does he hit you. Fair enough. He and hits the, Roy very hard. Yeah. Like, other, other than that, yeah. I, I think, think okay, no, matches yeah, are the same. Matter. Roy's not going to live too long against, like, right there, that Roy, F tilt. No, but cleaning up that stuff. Like Bowser, it's, it's the same shit. It's like whether or not they combo him a bunch. He just wants to do big damage, catch them missing their aerials. Yep. I think I think flame breath at ledge is going to be great I for Bowser out here. Shield then. I think shield shield's one of the few things um, that can punish a lot of these uh, aerials on the field just because of how much movement it has. Oh yeah, doesn't really matter how you space it. All right, so let's see here. Oh, side B almost killing Bowser. Uh, yeah. Man, Boy, smash feels so small. Okay. Good tech though. That, that was, was a great really tech. tech. Let's see, getting up. Nope. The other way, though. Hits him with the bear. I think he was because he was facing that way when he countered. Yeah. It'll yeah. be a oh Bowser. Oh my goodness, almost gets a huge F smash right Going for the soul down. read there. This is the reverse nair. He kind of has really good nair usage. That's the one thing I picked up uh, a few times I played him. Yeah, man. I really like his usage of void nair. I feel like nair gets overshadowed because of back air and forward air. and Yeah, yeah. And like every yeah Jer. But Roy's nair, pretty crazy. Bit of stream lag, you say? Uh, again? Okay. Seems like we're uh, just dropping a few frames. Uh... No notification on it I don't in the last little here. bit. I think it's just the internet. Should bring, I guess, no, there's nowhere internet to Internet bad. Now. Yeah. Like Wi-Fi is sus. Yeah, sorry about any technical difficulties. Hopefully it's still uh, watchable. But Nakano, climbing right back in there, now with a percent lead. Yeah. Oh, he does have a percent lead. Oh, we missed that one. Yeah. Oh, fiddling with the stream. Speaking yeah. of watchable, that, that Roy ledge trapping was a little hard to watch. Like, that's yeah. how much damage this character does. Holy. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh, that flame breath will leave that's what I'm right saying. Flame breath at ledge. He's going to make it back. Yeah, almost even percent exactly. But he's going to eat a lot. Jab will do it. Oh, the gentleman jab kills. Yep. Can't spot dodge two him. No. All right. I'll be out of shield. Classic uh, also, Bowser stuff. Also, that's so a percent bad. where his uh, neutral getup has less iframes. So, it also could have just caught him uh, neutral getup. Like. Perhaps. That was a really good forward to even the stock count. Yeah, Roy, man, those aerials. So let's get even. If, even if you're heaviest character in the game, one up be. You gotta watch out. Okay, yeah, punch that with a falling up air. That was really smart. You know, oh, Anna. combo getting started? No. Nope. Oh, Bowser falls these, out of it. Uh, falling up air is putting some work here. <laughs> oh, down air. Big down air. That's ballsy. Uh, oh, like speaking of down airs, down. yeah. Good option if you you're expecting the flame breath. Dude, I love seeing this uh, dash boosted forward tilt. Uh, oh wow! If that was strong hit, that might have killed. Uh, Bowser's pretty heavy, but Roy's side B is oh. insane. Yeah, oh! Really good DI, really good DI. Oh, waits out the counter. the counter. So Roy's counter doesn't have very good action frames. Yeah. But it has insane scaling. It's like 1.5 times. Correct. And of course, if you get the sweet spot, it's just a Roy move. It's very powerful. Oh, I don't think counters have sweet spots. I, I think, think his Roy's counters does. does. I think it has a, a hillbox. Does it have a hillbox? 
got a hill pox, yeah. Huh. It, I, I believe so. I, I believe I've, so. I've definitely gotten hit by that move sometimes. It had to send me nowhere because it but hit me. But the noodle hit head. isn't as exaggerated as it is on a lot of his other moves. Yeah, it still scales with the strength of the move that hits it. It's just. Uh, oh, oh, that's the punish. That'll do yeah. it. Yeah, really good bait out there. Roy side B. Cloud Faking, could never. Fake that landing, bait out that get up attack, hit him with that side B. Not going to take game one against. Uh, the Dang. weekly champion, Diddy Dang. Dang. And this week. will this be the earliest he's ever been eliminated? Yeah, I guess he, the one week he didn't win, he went out in second and grand. Yeah, he was yeah. still, he was still silver. Second. We'll see. Nakano's getting a lot of mileage off of those side Bs at ledge. That's just how talented this weekly is, man. Yeah. I think, yeah, I mean, it's been a crazy well, speaking week. Speaking of talent, we have some talented commentators right now. I'm oh, just yeah. saying. Oh, yeah. You know it. You got the trio going on here. Sorry if it's a bit chaotic, the but try away. The two O and twoers and Mr. Kazuya himself. Let's go. All right, what's the music counter pick? This is people Team underappreciate Galactic. this. Team Galactic. Oh, Team Galactic. I'll take Galactic. it. Good I'll take it. really misses PS2 this week. Now, one interesting thing I do want to relay to stream because they can't see this is Nakano does play standing up. It's kind of goaded. It's got to be a little intimidating if you're. If you're playing against them. The mental damage is off the charts for sure. Yeah. Yeah. It's like with the standing desk, you know, the blood is flowing, you're more focused. Mm -hmm. I did ask him about that. He said he does feel he plays better standing up, which I can honestly respect. I respect it, yeah. It's unique. Absolute demon. Demon, correct. <laughs> oh, just punishes that wow. neutral tech. Menacingly. All right, let's see here. Getting into game two. This is a best of three, so this is this could this be, could be his the end. Is it both players? It's a tournament set? Depending on if they lose or not. Oh. Bowser's pretty close to kill percent, but that said, uh, Bowser can make a percent step set up really quickly. Oh, yeah. And that weight difference, even with oh, Roy's insane kill power. That could have been an F smash. These, these fire breaths have not been working out for D-Tank this game. No. No, not going to play around them super well. That's an F tilt, by the way. That feels like a forward smash it's from most other than a lot characters. It's forward smash if you get that sweet spot. Yep. Yeah, dude. Forward tilt, Roy's is nasty. I mean, it did almost kill Bowser from across the stage at 114, so... All right, let's see. That forward air, though, that is also nasty. That, ooh, ooh chases him off. Enough. Super armor on uh, up bailing out Roy there. And Side B might do it with the rage, just nope. barely. Solid really DI. Good, uh, grab read there. All right, let's see. Bowser excels at ledge trapping, but not this time. Noodle. Let's see here. Now What's that? Speaking of excelling at ledge trapping. First? Oh, it's going to oh. be Bowser. It's the blood flow? Absolutely. Not going to use that blood 170. flow. 170. I don't think he's living much longer. Oh. oh. Bowser can pile on a lot of extra credit. Oh, last hit. I think that might have shield poked. I think I think he dropped that shield for that last that hit. Yeah. That was a shield. What? I, I think that was a shield drop. Ah, uh, that's unfortunate. Dude, Bowser's shield was huge. Fair that enough. Was really hard to poke. Those multi hits, man. Sometimes oh, it's a little big hard. Big up smash. Right. And then going straight for the up smash too. Wow. But not gonna try to end his whole career with that down air. My Forward God. Throw. What's the What's the edge guard? Ooh, misses a little bit. Oh, Gets nice up high recovery as opposed to going straight to ledge to get that damage there. Right, let's see what we flame got. Flame breath. Here. Once he's again, down -air getting punished for it. These down air, up air combos. But uh, uh, for Nakano. Uh, All right, let's see here. Oh, the jabs clank and he gets grabbed for it. Mm, we're gonna be sent way off stage. Scoop, and he goes low for that forward air again. <laughs> you want to update the score, by the way? It's uh, it currently. Is, it is update. It's one out. Oh, it's 1 0 for Nakano. Yeah, yeah. Oh, dude. Oh, yeah, yeah. It's okay. Overlay is just a little wrong. It's I was fine. like, yeah, no, it's updated. Our it's 1 0. I was gonna say. Yeah. So just uh, to clear up any confusion, it is 1-0 for Nakano. Yes, not Diddy, though. But Diddy going to find that kill to make it 2-1 in the stock count. He's trying to stay alive here. This is his tournament game. Uh, 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 oh, Nair into F tilt, piling on the percent. Going to eat that back here for so flame breathing, though. He's getting yeah. nothing off these flame breaths. No. Normally, he punishes his opponents. It's ooh, it's, it's a pretty good part of Bowser's game plan, too. Sometimes you just do yeah. 30 to people for existing, but if uh, Nakano remains punishing these as well as he does. Man, now there we go. The up smash. It might be bad, but it will kill. Yeah. And now only 70%. Only 86%. All right, it's definitely looking good for Diddy here, but. Only 111%. Only 121%. Oh, Roy makes it back from these. He's not quite dead yet. <laughs> oh, there we go. This could be bad. This is Diddy Dank's tournament stock here. Okay. He's still alive. Dang, this is a Roy with max rage, though. This is very dangerous. Oh, oh that might do it. Will Forward do it. throw will yeah. do. Yeah. No, it oh, won't. Good DI. Great DI. Let's oh, see, see here. Uh, oh, oh, that'll do it. Yeah. That'll do it. That was good a scary knowledge. situation. Great work from Diddy Dank. Yeah, good, no, good knowing that his opponent would be scared, yep. trying to hide it in a shield there, and just snatching him right I out thought, of it. I uh, thought when he got off ledge on second stock there, he was going to bounce with that. Not going to lie. 
Possible. Honestly, but. yeah, just cheese, cheese, cheese. Yeah. Roy. So the thing is, uh, the character who's lower percent has yes. control of where it goes. Yeah, but Roy had higher percent. Yeah. Well, yeah. Did. yeah, he did. So, it could. It was an option, but Diddy Dank uh, cleans it up regardless. Going into the final game of this set here, one yeah, way or another. Three. Let's see. We see any character switches? I think we're probably uh, nah, sticking with the Bowser. I do consistent. Mikado, Mikado has been playing Joker tonight, but oh, has that he? is not a good matchup against Bowser. You definitely want to have a sword. Yeah, I think also just that absurd kill power of Roy helping to even out the differential a little bit here. Can actually take these stocks off of Bowser earlier than he usually likes to lose them. Yo, we just got a new follow from Lee Mayo. Hey. Oh. Lee Mayo. Lee Mayo. Mayo. Mommy? That's, 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 oh, Mommy. That's mommy, my mommy, guess. Mommy. Well, thanks for the follow, Lamamio. 30% from Whirling Fortress? And yeah, speaking of uh, following, Bowser oh, kind of following Roy all around the stage say, here. 64 uncontested percent on Roy, but now Roy is clapping back with 40% of his own. Oh, yeah. the Flame Breath connects yeah, this time. Barely catching Another 40 piled on. Let's see here. Oh, side B. That's not uh -oh. Gonna kill. oh, no, and the Poo Poo DI. Ah, we'll pay for that. that was a little suspicious for sure. Just a touch. Listen, I don't blame people for DI. I don't oh, no, DI. no. Oh. I don't know how to DI, so... That's because you're too busy being carried by Cloud. True. Carried by Cloud. You don't have to DI when your character wins for free. Mm. I'm a top tier actor. Yeah. Cloud slander aside, oh my God, Diddy Dank is really, really extending this lead. Oh, oh my God! That was absolutely nasty. Great stuff. Diddy Holy Dank. Holy crap. Diddy Dank trying to inflict as much mental damage as he can before this game is over. Trying to ensure that he keeps his life in this loser's bracket here. That was disgusting. All right, we are not in Bowser's side range just because of the percent difference here, but it's on the table as a possible way this game could end. Who knows, one good Roy F smash read, though, and this stock is over. Oh, well, speaking of what, she tried it. There, yeah. All right, let's see here. Bowser so far piling on 37%. Uh, it's not no off. punish. Okay. I wonder if Roy F smash would have killed there just I from the other side. He with his jab there, which is why he did that. All right, let's oh, see. Look at run up F tilt. Uh, now he's on up F tilt, yeah. What's the ledge drop? That was up tilt. Oh, yeah, right. Ooh, okay, oh, okay only 37 even. extra credit after being up an entire stock. That is insane. All right. Down air to kill Roy. We are back. last if stock. Roy takes the stock. Oh, dodge. Let's Tries see. The Fortress, okay, eats the upper. Fortress, Believe it or not, this is kill percent against oh, some of Bowser's moves already. Bowser bomb. Oh, Bowser Oh, Flame Breath, too. Ready to kill Roy at any time. Yeah, Roy is one hit. Side B will kill here, probably. It's six frame, terrifying six frame option. Okay, now it definitely will. Definitely. Let's yep. see, what's the ledge trap? Who goes to the up smash again? Misses though. No, Roy? Putting That's something together. Roy with a little bit of rage, his strings become a little untrue. But also, he starts killing you at That's absurd that, percents, yeah, even if your name's about. He's at kill percent now. Really crazy oh, this yeah. is actually really close. Doesn't finish the side B, saves his life. He's gonna be punished. Uh, All right, let's see. Oh, this is getting very close. Roy is. Oh, oh missing! No. Oh, that'll do it. That'll he do it. Had the air dodge wow. Wow. He eyed it correctly this time. A little early, but it doesn't crazy. quite matter. Wow. That, that game was shit. a little closer. <laughs> that, that was so oh, close. Man. Crazy stuff yeah. from Diddy Dank and Nakano. Nakano got to be proud of himself. Oh yeah. Uh, yeah, Dude, taking uh, taking the uh, you know really promising one of the top seeds still, into yeah. Yeah. actually seeded number scenario. one this week. Yep, almost took him right out. So the top seed. Great stuff from Nakano. I might have to start playing standing up. Uh, right. Definitely that, that seems to be the new tech. Yeah, might be the new tech. I think we're moving on to losers semis. If I had to guess now, it's keeping uh, losers bracket. I think it's another losers bracket match. Yeah. Yeah, losers is a bit behind it's winners be like here. Like Sly and Arif, I believe. Ooh, that'll be a, that'll be a very interesting match. Ice Climbers Inkling, probably yeah. we're looking at. Let's go, Diddy Dank. Correct. Diddy Dank, uh, always fun to root for. We love a heavy boy. We can do that for anyone playing Bowser. Oh, thick boy. We've got a pretty big barrier three. Yeah, I think we're waiting for Sly and Reef. I believe so. This is a. I mean, we've got Diddy Dank, Sly, and Reef left still. It's kind of crazy. There's some killers. I was I was saying earlier when uh, Bermentos dropped Diddy Dank into losers. Losers bracket is not happy about this. You hate to see that you uh, you lost one of your matches and now you got to go up against the tournament champ, but let's see how Sly versus Arif goes here. Should be a very interesting matchup. Yeah. Okay, this is losers uh, finals. <laughs> this is losers semis. This was losers quarters. So. <laughs> oh, is it still losers quarters? Okay. Yeah, losers quite behind. Let me check the bracket here, but. Oh, I can I can see that stream delay in our, in practice as uh, 
about a minute after the match is over, we've gotten the duality of man. Uh, Lamemio saying, let's go, and Instrumental Panda oh, lamenting <laughs> Diddy Dank's victory. That's how it goes. It's part of the process. Are they, go are they going on stream for Losers Quarter? Okay, yeah, we're going to have the rest of the game tonight on stream, I think, because there's... There's only losers, uh, like the there's losers, losers matches quarters. and then winners finals, and then well, and then obviously. Do you have time to do all these games on the stream? That's what I'm thinking. I think so. it's a bit of a bottleneck right now. With we usually finish around ten, right? So we've got time. Okay, we'll have losers semis off stream. Fair enough. Uh, ha have it at the same time as uh, yeah, so winners we'll finals. Yeah, so have winners finals after this game. Okay. And then have losers semis off stream. Sounds That's good. a good idea. And then we can have losers finals on stream. Yep. And yeah. Yeah. We we'll have the three finals. Fair enough. Wait, so my finals? Uh, uh, you we'll will not be. Just win your lose. Just yeah, win yeah, your game, I, and then. I play. I play Aegis or. Uh, Probably or Inkling Arif. Sephiroth or yeah Arif. Okay. It's the winner of Sly and Arif. Arif, of course, yeah, uh, been performing very well at oh, his way, previous appearances at this local, but Sly, newcomer to this local. I mean, yeah, you saw that Ice Climbers he match. He's got the sauce. The old weekly's before the pandemic. He was at. He Correct. Was Play some friendlies and stuff. So I've heard. Totally cool guy. I want to fight him. And very good. You love to see a Canadian ice climber is making it big. I want to play him for I remember, um, I kind of cheesed him when I played him previously, but he might have oh, done yeah. some serious labbing since. Sly was telling me earlier that he's on the hunt for Sal. Sal, not here this week, but, uh, Sly. Sly said that he uh, played Sal in a money match a few years ago and kind of got his, uh, got, got the hands a little, and now he's ah. on a hunt. To, to destroy Sal, so Sal very talented. Uh, for those of you unaware, he uh, he wins the weekly most of the weeks he comes. A very good ZSS player, so he's only he's only been here three he's only been here three times I think, or was it twice? Well, I thought it was just twice. twice. No, he lost to. Um, he came Campbell. fourth over the reading week or something. Oh, I wasn't here for the reading week one, yeah. so I don't know about that. Four times. I think. Oh, he, did he lose to the Zelda? Yeah, he did. He's she was bro. Don't don't fuck with that Zelda player. No. That Zelda player is kind of nice. But yeah, just an interesting little. Uh, Side rivalry there. Sly on his Sasuke mission to defeat Diddy Dog. Or to defeat uh, Sal, my bad. Just win, forehead. Yeah, absolutely. I don't see the. Pro I mean, that's the, that's, the, that's the motto I've been following so far. Instead of uh, losing, why not just win? I'm on that just lose train, five head. Okay, I'm gonna go take a break from the commentary. Hey, no worries. You guys got this? Yeah, we're good. Ooh, Chris, Chris seems to understand yeah, the setup. Yeah. Why, why win if you could just oh, lose? Yeah. I under, honestly, if you go 0-2, you can spend the rest of the night commentating. That's, that's my shot. That might be that might be the tech. That might be the tech. I might have to try that. But then you don't make any money. Ah, uh, you know. You don't make any money either way. Yeah. <laughs> you do if you win. Yeah, you make like I, 20 wouldn't, bucks. Wouldn't that's not bad. It's not bad. That's like. Uh, that's a legend. Make like 15 or 20 bucks. Uh, that's it costs five bucks to get in, so you make like. 10, or you can get 40 nuggets from Wendy's. I haven't seen it with my own eyes, so like I don't think it's legit. How much is 40 like nuggets from Wendy's? Uh, five is two bucks, so you could get 50 actually. Wait, I'm getting nuggets from Wendy's after this. I think you can get 20 for 10. No, it's 40. Yeah, you can get 20 for about 10. So that's pretty worth. I think Karma will be down for a Wendy's run after this. Probably would be. So I, I gotta face the winner of this. Oh yeah. Yeah, you do. Right? Who do you want, Arif or Sly? I don't know. I kind of want to face the ACs, but you I'm want, happy for Arif. Oh. You want to? You want to see? You want to see what the ACs are saying? Yeah. So we got. Fun. That sounds like fun. I do want to. <laughs> that sounds but like fun. Ice honest, climbers. I, I also think Bowser does pretty well. Kazimishima. Yeah, we got. Uh, so Bowser. Do you think Bowser has an easier time against Inkling or ICs? Uh, probably. <laughs> if the ICs know what they're doing. Like, Sly knows I mean, what he's doing. No, I mean, I'll tell I don't, you that. I don't mean like that, but I mean, no, like, no, I know, I know. I'm just saying. He thinks ah. maybe Bowser could struggle a little bit. If the ICs finally reach their potential. They just yeah, have so yeah, much yeah, potential, yeah, bro. 20XX ICs. Yeah. But I think uh, Bowser would have an easier time. Give Inkling. Uh, with, uh, with ice climbers. Yeah, Inkling gives Bowser a little bit harder of a time. Yeah, just, just like with like slap on and like back air. And, and then like the, the booyah kill confirms like they're... They're, they're a lot more annoying than like what what the ICs have. What about Pikachu though? Yeah, the the up throw up air. Yeah, oh. up throw up air. Booyah! I didn't know that was called Booyah. Yeah. Oh yeah, it is. <laughs> they got we got we got great names for everything in this game. What about Arif got a pocket Sephiroth? How do you feel about that? I feel fine. Feel fine against that. Against that? The Booyah, yeah. man. The booyah up throw up air. Booyah. Yeah. Light enough where I don't feel like scared going in, and I can just get the kills. A That's bit fair. Easier, just kind of like rushing. Sephiroth <laughs> always in. surprisingly light. Yeah, especially with like when I hit him with like a side beat. Correct. You see what stage they picked there? Smashville. Smashville. Sma oh, Smashville with the moving platform. Moving Smashville. 
So if this is, assuming this is Inkling and uh, ice, ice Climbers likely here. likely will be. Yeah, Reef has a Sephiroth, but he usually pulls the Inkling out first. At least game one. Game one, I think, is, is definitely an Inkling. Easy to combo, so I don't know if I'd want to pull the Sephiroth. That's fair. He might be going random here. Random. Oh. 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 <laughs> Just teasing us a little Come bit. On. Oh. Actually going Inkling boy. Random chat. Inkling boy. All right. Let's see here. So, Smashville. This whole it's Inkling, Ice Climbers. What do you guys think? Who do you I guys have in this Inkling's matchup? I think Inkling's going to have to dance for this matchup. To you think work. so? You know, he's going to have to be playing in and out of Icy's range, get him to overcommit, and then just kind of whip punish because you can't really approach that wall of hitboxes when you're stubby little Inkling. To be fair, if, if you are Inkling, though, you're fast enough to really whip punish a lot of those laggier Icy's options. Oh, yeah. Like that side B right there, for example. Side B doesn't have lag. Oh, yes, it does. Uh, no. Icy side B does not reflect. No, it's not Rob's side B, thank God. Uh, yeah. All right, let's see. I mean, it's I not think, going great know, for Inkling so far. In. So far, you're definitely being proven right, but let's see here. It's just Inkling versus two Inklings. Oh. Oh. What if Icy's was twice as good as Inkling? <laughs> All right, let's see here. Ooh, that up oh, smash is not quite killing. Icy's aerials do so much damage in knockback. Uh, like, when you get, like, those... Those back airs and up airs, they, they, they add up pretty quickly. Correct. Yeah. Forward air is basically just forward smash. Yeah. Aerial edition. It's, it's like a mix of uh, Dr. Mario and Mario with uh, forward air. All right, let's see here. Like the stale one and then like yeah. You got the funny aerial and you got the welcome to New York. Yeah. <laughs> the welcome to New York. <laughs> I mean, oh, oh Arif has been doing smash. a great job just dancing around this range yep. so far. He's I made up a lot of that percent. Oh, good parry, but no punish. Nothing off it. Interesting. All right. Keeping their distance here. Yeah, the main thing you're going to want to do when you're facing ICs is separating them. And I think uh, Splat Bomb would definitely be the way to go. That's fair. Yeah, Splat Bomb, Roller, probably your two best tools, roller Down Smash. Well, yeah, if you ever hit Roller, it's uh, you love to see it, but a little easier said than done sometimes. Time, when, when one of them stunned it, it's, it's really hard to punish it because the other one will normally not be stunned and then... Uh, just hit you. And then hits you, yeah, exactly. Yeah. And then you don't get the free punish. Always got to be on the, the lookout. Most thing about fighting this character is you don't get free punishes if you like break one of their shields. I think the most annoying thing is like accidentally grabbing Nana and then having Popo just bitch slap you. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely a possibility. That so, tilts me. <laughs> slower paced game here, but we're looking at oh, Ooh, big up smash. Almost Not commentators killing. cursed it there, but still on the first stock here between these two let's see who can get the first one out yeah i'll reef slowing it down a lot more after Ooh. getting kind of opened up the first 70 60 70 percent but ice is gonna find a stray back here for that kill as he probably should i mean i, I play neither inkling nor ices but it seems that inkling would probably benefit Big from like that. kobe from exactly that but nice. also from just keeping her distance and uh, or his distance in this case and trying Logo to go icling boy icling Iceling boy. Iceling boy. Inkling boy. Icelings. Ice climbers. I like Icelings. I'm going to call them Icelings. Icelings? But is it Inkling or, I or Ice Climbers? Are right, fully covered in the paints here? Up. That's. Oh do they make it back? They do make it back, but Nana, I don't know. Nana has bravely to sacrifice sacrifices her life for that. Herself. Yeah. But we've seen the Sopo. You know, we know with Sopo kind of goes crazy here. Sly Sopo is very good, well, as you can the, see. The roll read with the F smash, the patented. Sopo fighting for the honor of his dead wife slash sister. sister. No one really both. knows. I wish someone would tell us. I wish someone would tell us. Maybe, Nintendo, please. maybe Sly knows. Maybe you can ask him after the game. But just like oh, that. unfortunate. Yeah, side B also sends you into free fall, so uh, yeah. Really going for it, really. Can you grab ledge with side B or no? Possibly a miss input. So. Probably fell off the stage. Wasn't expecting it. Who knows? But fact of the matter is, we're now on a last oh. stock situation. Yeah, and Arif in a great position here at just 50%. Yeah, hugely laps him in percent now. Oh, that, that smash! He had some Barely. sauce on that. All he right. was going for the home run that bat. Big, yeah. <laughs> already, this stock has already done what it needs to do. 84% extra credit, but... One of the Inkling... Sorry, one of the Icy's uh, parried that down air, and the other one got hit. I hate this character. <laughs> oh hey, God. you know? Just like that, it doesn't look like it's that big of a lead anymore. No. It's, this is very... The Icy's have an insane damage output. This is definitely very doable, but, but almost, almost does. Boo, yeah. And that'll take it? No. Oh! A little weak? I have no idea Surprising. How, like what their where their weight category is. Uh, Icy's are kind of heavier than you'd expect. I feel like they're in like the high 80s, low 90s. Yeah. All that uh, snow gear they have. Yeah. The it's, the, it's the big mallets, you know. Oh uh, yeah. That's Popo. probably yeah, gonna be, no. Oh. Or Popo. Yeah. yeah, that Sopo recovery definitely uh, not great, but really nothing you can do there. <laughs> still very close game one. Uh, any a couple 
nonsense ICs aerials doing about 27%. Mm -hmm. Could have brought that to a very close situation very quickly. Yeah. But a reef doing a great job of exploiting the SOPO uh, or the split ICs once an opportunity does open up. So absolutely, exactly. It was going really well for the ICs until uh, until we started exploiting the recovery, and then that's when it all just kind of fell. Apart. Yeah, a little bit. So where do you think we're going for game two here? If you're uh, uh, Sly, what are you yeah. counterpicking? If I'm Sly, I'm uh, I'm probably going back to Smashville. Uh, or maybe small battlefield, definitely a smaller stage. Uh, yeah, I think give them less room to, to run, away. run away from me. Yeah, let me dictate the tempo a little bit more. But you know, we'll see. Arif might take that into consideration with his bands too. He's got two bands that he can still use. I uh, I imagine Arif probably banned FD as at least one of his stages. Oh, uh, you do not want ICs on FD. Yeah, that's a good point. ICs definitely have a great time on FD, but other than that, there's still enough small stages open that. Uh, it's going to be difficult to find, to force Sly into a large stage here. We, we can run away see, from him. Uh, a gentleman to Midgar if we're lucky. <laughs> <laughs> Is, yeah, anything's possible, but somehow I doubt it. Or Lila maybe, Cruz. Maybe Fountain of Dreams. Um, we melee boys. Yeah. yeah. In, the uh, favorite green greens, so we can get that melee wind back. Ooh. Let's see. Here. Oh, oh so we're going like to small battlefield. Small battlefield. The predictions were on point. I think Arif ended up banning Smashville and or FD and Hall of well, Bastion. Yeah. Let's see here. I mean, it is worth noting that Arif did a pretty good job of running away from him, even on Smashville, oh, even yeah. on that smaller stage. Inkling, I think, just has uh, has the mobility to kind of dance around the One of the player. fastest initial dashes in the game. Yeah, especially since uh, the ICs don't have the fastest moves ever, so it's kind of hard to react uh, in time, especially with Inkling move, moving on so quickly. And the hitboxes are a little stubby at the end of the day. Yeah. Let's see here. Oh, oh. Zelda? What are that's, we getting? That's why you'll see the uh, ICs go. Grudo Valley, that. Song of Storms. Grudo <laughs> Valley. Valley, solid pick. So you're talking pick. about actual gameplay stuff, oh, and we're just yeah, here yeah. talking about the music Grudo Valley. Grudo oh. Valley. Hey, people underrate music counterpicks, man. That's some important that's what mental I'm game. Yo, my, my last two games, I had Team Galactic going. Yeah. It's like, a respectable music counterpick. Yeah. <laughs> Can't I, beat uh, the team of Galactic. I beat yeah. World of Light just so I'd be able to counterpick to Darkon. Team Galactic music anymore? Nah, you can. You can. You guys can it's share just, our music counter pick. Just, just not. Know, just don't it might do it against for you. Yeah. What yeah. happens happens. Yeah. yeah. No, no, right. no Pokemon stages. No, you can go to small, the, oh, small battlefield. Small battlefield. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Forgot about that. All right. So as expected, running it back with the same characters. Sly seems to be a ice climber specialist, and a reef. No reason to switch off. No. After that first Very game. Very comfortable in that inkling. Game two, small battlefield. I don't think the ICs did anything necessarily wrong in the first game. I think they just kind of. Like God just died early because of uh, just because of the AI of, uh, of Nana. There was yeah. definitely some Sopo exploits there for sure, but yeah. Arif just solid, I think. Uh, Icy's knowledge and counterplay. He's gonna need to see some adaptation here, as far as getting in on Arif a little better from Sly. But so far, 50% to 24. Oh, big downer. Starting to build Chasing up a bit of a Chasing after Nana lead. though, not going after Popo, who we actually landed the downer on. Actual animal abuse. Trying to get rid of Nana ASAP, Rocky. Let's see here. That blizzard very dangerous, oh but gosh, oh, reflecting, reflect? yeah. <laughs> I didn't, yeah. I didn't know uh, uh, Ice is uh, sense, those yeah. those ice particles are basically just Gordo. Any hitbox will send them right oh, back 100%. where they came from. So let's see. I think the platforms really uh, benefit Inkling here. Put on that quiet ass Game and Watch song. Game Flat Game Zone One. Flat, Flat Zone Two. Flat Zone Two has got some beat yeah. to it. He's probably do, 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 do. Regardless, oh, it's a, oh. a stomp yeah. knee. Yeah. Stomp knee, knee. Down air, back air, back air, yeah. Cleaning up that first stock. Let's see if he can get some extra credit off this or if the ICs force him off of it. Oh, up tilt. What's the follow up? Yeah. Up air. Up tilt, up air. And the dash dance to try and inflict some mental damage before respawning off the angel platform. Keeps your hands warm, you know? Exactly. Make sure you got those uh, that APM ready. But 43% now. Slight lead for a reef, but... Like we've seen, uh, Ices can definitely put on the hurt in a hurry. Ices can pile up that damage like nobody's business. But hey, if you get covered in that ink, so can Inkling. So we already see that 43 turn into 67. If we're lucky, we might even see it turn into... Oh. <laughs> oh, just like that. No, Inkling doesn't have anything that does 2%. Does <laughs> up smash almost killing there off the, the roller berry. Still impossible to mash out, even at like 100%. That move is stupid strong. Yeah, you gotta have it, some. It's even stronger when you're losing as Inkling. What? Yeah. It's got it's a comeback. Built-in right? comeback, comeback mechanic. Yeah. Are you kidding Wait, me? What has a comeback mechanic? Learn uh, something new. Roller. Inkling roller. It's harder to mash out if you're winning against Inkling. What? Yeah. Oh. 
Yeah. All right. Take care, Instrumental Panda and uh, Brementos. They're wishing you good luck. Good luck for that cloud, bro. Thank you. Or they're wishing me good luck because I have to play you. It's it's a little <laughs> bit uh, unclear, but we'll take it. I'll, uh, I I'll think, pretend. I think they're wishing the, the I'll cloud. pretend they're wishing me good luck. <laughs> I don't think anyone's talking to Kazuya. <laughs> Nobody <laughs> wants Kazuya to win. Very and up air. The up air closing it out there. And now we're potentially getting into Sly's last stock of this tournament. This could be his tournament stock, but Inkling at kill percent for sure. So let's see what he can put together here. Nana kind of getting the hands, but he's fine. Just a little roughed up. She's got a little bit of paint on her. Yeah. Uh, the green honestly but goes with the pink. Honestly, parka. Per any percent on Nana is good percent. Especially getting that percent difference between Nana and Popo can really start to help separate them. Yep, yeah, because exactly. the knockback growth is crazy on yeah. Nana. So, Are you know? Playing so safe right now. As he should, he's I think. So again. safe. Approach. No. I don't blame him. Yeah, I, I think I think you I think you definitely uh, you just run away here. This is a game of neutral B, down B, and down tilt right now for him. Yeah. Look at that. Ooh, oh, and that's why you really want to run away. For the down tilt, yeah. yeah. Honestly, twenty-five percent. No, not yeah. that much. I mean, this is very even. Like and no, it's, it's more than even. even. Yeah. It's yeah. more than even. It's like point. that slide takes the lead, but I don't know. I feel I like the ICs definitely have the potential to pull this back. Pull this back. Good parry, but nothing off of it. All right. The oh, guard. the jump read. That was almost the, the spike box. That forward air is so scary off so from the ice. It can just you know obliterate the, your you stuff. I don't think it does. Okay. I don't. Oh my god! The like grenade going right through Ooh, both yeah, climbers. Right wow, that. that could have been disastrous. Oh, speaking oh, of disastrous, in the, a in reef the corner, a lot of pressure. The desync is active. Is out of there. Yeah. Oh, oh like getting one of them with the roller, but Nana there to guard. That's all we were just talking about. Yeah. Sometimes you can't even get the punishes you earned on this character, but... Just like that, it's even. It is even, and yeah. we're... <sighs> Two splat bombs Both at later. kill percent now. Inkling uh, may struggle to kill occasionally, but 130 on Ices should be... Uh, oh, sending Nana way off stage. He makes it back, though. Oh! And he has smash! Oh! And he doesn't wow. need it. He said, I don't need Nana. He said, get me back into this. Killed him at, like, 95 with that F smash. Oh, that yeah. was... Whew. There's definitely a, a notable kill power differential in this matchup. Icy's have some serious power behind some of their hits, and Inkling, uh, not so much. Not so much. This Icy keeps clutching out games like crazy. Like crazy. Like actually. <laughs> this Icy's is wild. Uh, Absolutely. Icy's is the real comeback mechanic. So we're going to move into game three. So the decider. If you... If you have to counter pick here, you're you're inkling. You just got. Uh, I'm inkling. I have to counter pick. I'm going straight to town and city faster than you can. Fair enough. Town. I mean, I'm I'm locking in. Town's town definitely a great option. Probably too good of an option. I can't imagine it, uh, it'll stay on the board, but we'll have to see. You got nice tall platforms that you can camp on ice uh, ice climbers on. The aerial also game is that good. Though. Just adds an element of uncertainty to that uh, story. Hazard oh, smash. You guys are forgetting. He, he's killing them with forward smash, and uh, Town and City is very uh, close to the last ones on the side. It's so true. I, don't, I don't know if you want to head over there. Yeah. I don't know if you want to head over there when. Like, ah, just don't. Just, forward smash. just don't get forward smash. But here's you know? the thing. You, you die, but you die even earlier, which I don't know if that's something you want to do against Ices. Give, give them that momentum. Fair enough. And Inkling, right, uh, so the bands are Battlefield and Hollow Bastion. Inkling does like to kill off the top with that buoy as well. So that's true too. Highest legal ceiling, uh, town and city, probably not the mm -hmm. best option. At least make that kill power differential worse. But hey, lots of room to run away if you want to play lame. <laughs> Are we thinking about his options win, here? Win games. No Battlefield, no Hollow Bastion. Might see a Northern Cove. Might see a small Battlefield. Hard to say. Hard to say. Smashville again. Okay. Back to Smashville. <laughs> Doesn't mind the uh, smaller size of stage. Sly is offering a gentleman to gamer, but a gentleman to gamer. This is interesting. Now that's a music counter pick. I don't know if you guys have heard gamer, but that stuff is mentally shattered. This would be hazards on gamer, by the way. That's hazards a good point. Gamer. So Mama would be on, and she would be. Uh, She'd be getting mad at everyone and being up past their bedtime. If they gentlemen into the hazards on gamer, they've both won this tournament in my eyes. <laughs> yeah, I, know, I, I don't know if there are no losers. I give them both for a That's pretty big chat energy. This is 1 1 2. This is the game. This decides the set. If they gentlemen into the gamer, that's some uh, solid gamer energy. Yeah, this is it. 
Uh, losers oh, okay. semis won't be. So after this, me and you are gonna play, and he's gonna play the winner of that off street, and then winners, losers, and grands. You better, you better make your way back to grands. Uh, you, th you think, you think we're gonna go down at four? Hey, you better yeah, make your way back to grands first, man. I just have to make a bigger run today, so that, I, I gotta play a little bit more. That's no big deal. Yeah, big deal. All right, so the gamer dream is dead, unfortunately. Gamers remain the most oppressed echelon of society. We're going back to Smash Bros. Amen, Wars. brother. Preach. No one, no one faces oppression more than us. We're all gamers. We can, we, we can attest to it. <laughs> so, probably not going to see any kind of switch here once again from Marie, if I had to guess. Seems pretty comfortable on the inkling. Just a couple things didn't go his way that game. But. Maybe switching up the ult. Never mind. Going and this Icy here. seems to be a character specialist. Uh, yeah, I mean... You don't pick Icy's and pick up a second. One of those characters with so much... Uh, Attack and execution barrier that it's kind of hard to reasonably pick up a secondary. But I don't know when you're playing Ices all the time, then you play a character like Pyra and Mithra. I don't know, but they, they seem kind of appealing. I think when when you see how easy it is to kill with them, so maybe they have like a, a pirate pit bro. Maybe that's <laughs> hey, maybe that's what it is. You know, maybe you don't, you want to avoid playing uh, a top tier because you'll be seduced out of your. Ooh. Notable. So what just happened here for those of you who can't see? Sly plays all of his games with his own music on his phone, uh, with headphones on, and his phone just died. Now, this is some this is some serious mental damage for Sly, and perhaps some serious icing for Arif. Though he did lose the last game, so maybe it's uh, Sly who's the one who needs to be iced. Thoughts, yeah. <laughs> As if I think he says. Or he will sit there, head empty, no thoughts, only booyah. Roller. Uh, Sometimes head empty, no thoughts, only roller. I'll, I'll Google it for you right now. I'll throw up, throw Icy's kill confirm percent. Only so. splat bomb. Arif saying uh, he uh, is not familiar with the kill percents or the yeah. percents where booyah is true. So let's, let's tell him. Mm -hmm. Fair enough. Let's, let's make this spicy. Hey, this is this is commentator bias. I'm just gonna pull it out right here. I do not condone assisting the players in this fashion. We need to get a little bit of a break from the action here in this uh, this set. I'm curious. Hey, I, I don't know the percents for Booyah either, so everyone on stream might uh, get a chance to learn as well here. Apparently it is, yeah. Oh, Where it's, man. oh yeah, I guess this was part of the uh, the Inkling nerfs uh, back in the day. Booyah seems to have, have an exactly 1% window where it's true on everyone here, so. Just, uh, I now understand why Arif does not know the percents for Booyah. It doesn't seem that helpful. It's got, he, that, that almost has Luigi syndrome where if you're at like 106 or something, just get hit. Or if you're at 109, just get hit by something else. Uh, and then it's no longer true, so. Yeah. Damn shame. Damn shame. You hate to see it. Battle of the, uh, the low tiers here. <laughs> Inkling and Isis. Inkling, not a low tier. No, you know how it is. I just wanna, uh, just two, wanna, two honest low tiers. Propaganda. What? What in, what in God's? Two name? honest low tiers just playing it out. <laughs> no, no, we I'm were so. I'm trying, to, I'm trying to look up some up throw up air percent. Yeah. There we go. Oh, I see, I see. The percent graphic. Uh, Quick, let's start coaching him. <laughs> this might is this pre nerfs? What time? What what year is this? This is 2018. That is probably pre nerf. What nerfed? Uh, they, they, I think they nerfed. Uh, uh, I think they nerfed Booyah. What? I think so. I think uh, people, everyone was talking about how Inkling was top two when the game came out, so she got uh, probably well, unfairly it's exactly. attacked. So. Oh. So yeah, that's not gonna happen. Sly <laughs> reviving his phone. Yeah, the yellow percent windows are so tight. Yep. On some characters, up throw up air literally has a one to two percent window. Pikachu uh, is only one of This is up throw up air percent window. Yeah, we're looking at booyah percents booyah right now percent? for those of you who can't. Uh, C here, yeah. yeah, which is everyone. And so I see the match numbers 111. 111. Well, if Sly's at 111, he better watch out. If he's slightly uh, above or below it, three IC windows when playing one character Pokemon trainer. <laughs> Pokemon trainer cringe. Imagine playing Pokemon trainer. All right, trainer game three. Top, top game three on Smashville. Yeah, Sly's got his music back, so his mental has been saved. They've both been iced out quite a bit. Pun intended with the ice climbers there, but. Getting into it. No stylist. Correct. Only 50%. Game three, right? Only this is game three. Up air, up air. True at every percent, apparently. And Arif's got to start working back this lead here, but it's still early. Oh, yeah. Very manageable. Oh, well faced back there, though. Let's see. We got the shield pressure. Oh, just jabbing on his shield. Sometimes Inviting best mix-up yeah. is no mix-up. Inviting him to drop it. 
And I'm going to side B right over your uh, your neutral B. Don't mm -hmm. mind if I do. Oh, gets hit by the blizzard. Doesn't quite freeze, though. Yeah, none of the freeze boxes. Only the wind boxes. Let's see here. Well, oh, that does so much yeah, shield. Yeah, the shield pressure is immense on that. I see split. They two different ways. Each. All right, here. Well, Looking like, like Moses. Parting the, parting the ICs. Correct. All right, let's see. So... We got oh that that, that he's that side B has just been uh, get out of jail free card so far but yeah let's see if that continues hard to punish him when you don't have a disjoint oh and he yeah. actually lives and I yeah. believe Nan is alive too so Both they are making it live. back but roller just so difficult to get out of kill sparks alive oh as and usual, but Nana dying for that brutally killing Popo's wife slash sister there slash Bo. <laughs> I, I think it's a and the back air. You know, I don't think it was well, ever we, confirmed. We for confirmation. So, wife slash they sister. They look so young. There's no way. That's just that's just like that's that just arcade most of their style. Faces, like, nah, they're, covered they're like in the the parka. No, no. They are. They, they well, that's. Look the exact same. Would children be living by themselves in the Arctic? I think Probably. not. I think that's not. just that Japanese anime style. You know how it is. You think ice climbers doesn't make the most? Next, like, you're gonna tell me. Makes the least amount of sense in this game out of all the characters. Next, you're gonna tell me Inkling's a kid. So, uh, Ice Climbers and their uh, romantic relationship or lack thereof aside, we or, got, or a completely platonic relationship. <laughs> uh, we got a Reef with a stock lead, 43% extra credit already. Still at 83. Stock's not yeah. looking too moldy, but. And kind of chasing down Nana here. Not giving uh, Sly a chance to set his offense and, you know, start his, uh, his cheating, you know? His cheating, yeah. Really so there. let's see what the edge guard is. Inkling, with that quick up B making it back, barely misses the Somehow blizzard. Somehow neutral there. get up, not getting hit by the blizzard. Timing Think. must have been just off. Yeah, stopped oh, that, it right that one before will do the it, This should be the stock. Oh, doesn't match out. Doesn't does the that. correct thing. Must have been diing up on that up tilt too, because missing the up air afterwards. No follow up. All right, let's see here. So this is looking, it's starting to get a little out of hand if you're sly, but again. That kill power differential means this is uh, this is very possible, and oh, that's God. looking a, a lot harder now. Inkling looked like a killing machine with that down smash. I hate to be the bearer of the commentator's curse, but it seems I may have been this time. You might have. Uh, you might have uh, now, ripped that wide open. I was just gonna say, as soon as, if, if he gets the stock off, one stock ahead is definitely a solid lead for a reef, but nothing Sly can't beat out of him if he uh, wins get, gets a couple of these neutral wins here. Again, I hate to sound like a broken record, but Icy's can really pile on that damage with a couple and of And we areas. might be seeing it now with the desync. Grab him at the ledge and barely missing the forward air. That would have been the spike hitbox. That could have been it. He almost getting a repeat of his clip against the Roy earlier. That was crazy. Yeah, I saw that. Shout out Diddy Dank commentary from Markules. Markules. Yo, let's go Markules. <laughs> it's the most game knowledge you could ask for. Correct. All right, so... Nice back air. Oh, oh and unfortunate side SD, B there. Buffering that side B, but being knocked off stage by the back air. This game sucks, by the way. This game <laughs> sucks. <laughs> this game sucks coming That'll out from the play. Play. His tournament, in and beta. nobody likes to see it end like that. Not the competitors, not the commentators, not you at home. Who's Sal sucks? That's Sal. Oh, <laughs> it's just Sal. <laughs> but yeah, still very well played set from the two of them. Unfortunate on that SD at the end there, but yeah. Yeah. still yeah. very close set. But nice job, Arif. He will be moving up. on to the next round. And I have to go play a big sword man. Big sword man. Big sword man. Oh, big, you two are going to be on stream, man. right? Yes, sir. Yeah, we're playing on stream. Hyped. It's going to be my boys on stream, Brick and Bro Mentos. No, last week. No, Yeah, I know. It sucks to see it go like that. Just setting up winners finals here, getting the overlay all ready to go. But uh, winners finals coming up here now. Brick and Brementos 
two explosive players. Uh, Brick, you know, one of the best uh, players in Advantage State, probably in the entire weekly. Uh, and on the flip side of that, you got Brumentz, who's one of the most safe and patient players that we have. So a very, a very fire and water matchup we got going on here. Uh, but these players <laughs> intimately familiar with each other's kind of game style because uh, they played a ton of friendlies together. So this is going to be very, very interesting. And Cloud gonna open up with the bread and butter that I'll be out of shield. You can't do anything unsafe on that shield, man, or he will just pile on the damage. Ooh, missing that electric or otherwise that would have been a ton of percent. But still keeping it pretty close, only a 20% width between these two characters. And now dropping that down to zero. Cloud with limit, gonna try to catch him off stage. But Kazuya with rage can kill him with the rage drive if he manages to catch him. That should be the stock. Yep, neutral get a rage drive, a very safe option. And now Kazuya at 104, Cloud at zero. Ooh, armoring through that down air with the F smash, but thankfully gonna cross him up, so no damage there. Tries to get him with the side B off ledge, not gonna find it. Cloud with limit. Kind of looking for this kill. Good F tilt, very patient, but the DI is present. Hollow Bastion wide enough that Kazuya can live. He is the eighth heaviest person in the game, but up smash out of shield should do it. Super quick frame 11 option that uh, will just nail together that stock. But here we go. We're in the mid percents now, and they are scrapping at each other. It's lagless. What's going to be the option? Good cross slash, just keeping him away. Oh, wow. Good trade on Kazuya's part, getting the up smash for that back air. But uh, now the raise drive versus the limit. He's going, he's glowing blue, he's glowing red. Whose glow is stronger? That should knock the limit out of Kazuya. Yeah, that's, that's no more limit. So 80% lead, but he's gonna die first. Oh my goodness. Charging the F smash in his face, welcoming the getup attack, and then armoring right through it. Not the most orthodox of punishes, but will be enough to take the stock just like that back air. And there are 20% apart. This is neck and neck, folks. Cloud approaching limit. Dive into the hot is activated, and we see Sora in the background watching over this match, praying that it goes hype. Ooh, no follow up after that forward air. Not getting the sweet spot, unfortunately. Oh, the electric. What are we going to see after this? Nair, another electric. What's the follow-up? Up B, 116, way, way up there. Almost killing. But Kazuyo, not. What are you doing? What are you doing? He must have thought he had a jump. He must have thought he had a jump and tried to recover low. Instead, giving up that stock when he was a good 70% up. Oh, you hate to see that. He was doing so, so well. That game was in his hands for certain. But a really unfortunate SD. Hopefully he's able to shake that off before the next game because he was doing fantastic before before that happened. But one nothing for Bromenso so far. He was given a bit of a gift and uh, let's see if he can make the most of that. It is a best of five, so plenty of time for adaptation on both parts of these players. And what stage are we gonna see? We're gonna be moving to small battlefield. Kazuya, you know, preferring stages without platforms like FD, um, but small battlefield, not a bad, not a bad pick in a pinch. You can do, you can do some nice, nice stuff with those uh, side platforms, down B command grab, uh, follow ups with uh, stature smash, and you know, he's he's got some sauce. But uh, yeah, both of these characters starting off extremely violently. First 20 seconds, and they're already both at 70. Tries to catch the neutral get up with the cross slash, but slightly misspaced. Oh, and he takes his stock at 80 with that dragon uppercut, sending him to the stratosphere. Team Rocket blasting off again. My god, that move is so strong. Kazi is fair and balanced. Lol. I agree. Lazy pops. We're going to see just how fair and balanced this character can be with the rage drive. 1.1 times knockback and damage. Cloud's going to want to 
take this stock really quickly, or this is going to look really bad for him. Mulliganing the stock, hit it with the Bowser side, and just go up 2-1, taking the safe option. I like it. I like it. You know, most of the time, uh, Cloud would have had control there because uh, he was lower in percent, but because it was the raise drive, that was the cause of your show, baby. And now Brick just splitting Brementos wide open, already 100% lead, and the game completely erasing what happened last game in an absolutely dominant fashion. That was disgusting. I think, how much damage did he do? Brementos, go, he did, he did 148 damage versus 312. That was, that was a bit one-sided here. <laughs> All right, Northern Cave. Uh, I do like this pick for Brementos <laughs> because, you know, it is the cannon stage. Invincible dash into kill move. Yeah, that move is hella intangible, invincible, everything you want it to be. Because he's invincible during the dash up, and then the entire swing itself of the dragon, dragon uppercut is intangible. So the move is completely unfuckwittable. But um, we're going to move on to Northern Cave. Genova is playing. This is, uh, you know, a great stage for Cloud, uh, cannon-wise. Brick is going nuts. Yeah, he went crazy that game. But uh, Brementos, really good at just recentering and uh, just refocusing in on his game plan. So I think we'll be able to see him do that this game. Um, already nice and tight to start it off, even percent-wise. But Brick, glowing blue, tries to get the read with the limit. Might have been an early stock, but not going to find it. Going to eat the up smash instead. And now, let's see, gets the grab, back throw off stage. J give me stage control. And now he plays the game of blue versus red. Blue wins again. Catching that two frame with the blade beam. That was fantastic. And Bramento's looking quite alive after that last game. You would have uh, hardly been able to tell that, you know, he's a regular top finisher. But now he's definitely showing it and giving Brick a hard, hard time here. Really punishing him for trying to kind of close the gap and get in. Kazuya not having any great disjoints. So Brick... Or sorry, Bermento using the full length of his sword to keep him away. And now red versus blue. We're seeing another rematch. Blue wins. Ooh, but not going to find that kill. And Kazuya is still glowing. But oh my goodness, almost charges another full bar of limit off of that knockback. Kazuya needs to find this rage drive. Just let it go, but he's going to be knocked out of him instead. And now Cloud trying to kill him with the blade beam at ledge, but nice stall underneath. Not going to find it. Up till almost killing and dash attack will do it. Brick is in a bit of trouble here. He's going to have to find something pretty soon. Electric will start it off. But back air into side B. That's a lot of, lot of good damage. Ooh. Oh, no, no true follow-up off of that. Not going to get the kill. And it's very, very dangerous for both of these players. Kazuya going to want to play a little safe here because limit will be enough to kill. Cloud should be at kill percent off of the end. Any next hit. Oh, my God. Reading that he wanted to stage spike him with the back air and said, no, you cannot mess with me off stage. I'm going to drag you all the way down straight to the pits of hell. What a read. Reversing that upbeat and just taking him out. Incredible. Best of five right now, it's 2-1. Two, 2-1 one. Two, one for Brementos. What an amazing finish from Brementos. And right now it's 2-1. We're going into game four. The silver suit has come out. I know for a fact that means Brick is getting serious. He is heating up. He wants a game five. He wants to enter grand finals on winner's side. He wants to sh have his best showing at this weekly that he has yet. And the only person in the way of that for him is Brementos and his cloud. And that up he had a shield. My goodness, what a good option. The overlap between Kazuya's effective range and the effective range of up he had a shield is just a circle. This poor character. 
he can't do anything unsafe on shield. And gonna eat that blade beam for his troubles and gonna die for his troubles. Unfortunately, air dodging gonna send him too far underneath the stage for him to recover. Oh, and another SD. Oh no, I, I think we're seeing the end here, folks. Uh, break two unfortunate slips of the fingers. Uh, obviously not meaning to do that. Um, but you know, it's not over yet. We, we might see him recollect himself and bring it back, but uh, this is a huge deficit and these characters, or sorry, these players are very even in skill. We'd have to see a crazy, crazy comeback for something to happen, but very, very unfortunate. Not the competitive last set that we wanted to be seeing here today in winner's finals. But of course, Brick will have the opportunity to redeem himself against Diddy Dank in loser's finals, which we will be watching on stream. So that'll still be crazy. And finding a stock, so no three stock either. He's not going down without a fight. He's not going silently into the night. Uh, something, something, more charge of the light brigade. I don't know, I'm not a poet. But uh, he's showing some fight, you know? And that's uh, that's what you want to be seeing. Even, even after two SDs like that, he's still going in his hardest and not giving up, bringing him to 50% on his second stock. And stalling out that side B, not gonna let him find the easy kill either. You know, Brick, uh, I, I, I did count him out already, but uh, he's not counting himself out. Still fighting, still in this. Ooh, going for that down smash, but just hopping it over, and that backer should be enough to do it. Yeah, good game. Very unfortunate with those two SDs, but um, you know, even with that, still managing to find a stock in 80%. So, you know, not a bad showing, and he's gonna have another chance to redeem himself in losers finals. It's not the end of his journey just yet. Levine, I'll loan you money, bro. I'll loan you money. Levine. Levine, I will loan you money. I will. Just five bucks. Five bucks. No. Levine, 50 cents. Fifty cents is not even a money match. Come on, you can money match it for fifty cents. Did you when you said against a reef? A reef one? I think that, that's the. I think that was the first time he's beaten you in tournament. Yeah. Yeah. Dude, it's so funny when like Levine would get limit and you would get raise drive. Yeah, it's like versus red versus blue. Huh? That last game. Tragic. I I don't know if you heard me, but no, I heard. yeah, I was just like sad. I'll loan it to him. Yeah. Yeah. Well, you want it now? Hold on. All right, can you, can you set it up for your losers finals? I'm gonna go spot Levine for this money match. Set up your own finals, Ah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Fair enough. What's that? Hey, we're, we're going right now. Yeah.
was just uh, setting it up for you. Here. Just, uh, just got I can't this. believe my lovely commentators did stream to go money match each other. Uh, what's the score right now? Did you start it? Losers Finals is about to start, and I was too busy playing friendlies. Where have I been? Yo, Sal's here? Sal, let's go. Are we versus Brick? I'm just updating. Oh, no, no. Gentlemen's the Yoshis. Arif, Arif, you're the Yoshis fan here. There we go. Yo, Sal, and every viewer, I am back. Actually, who wants to see my beautiful face? Hello, hello, people. <laughs> Brick is going nuts, dude. He's running through people tonight. Yo, I was so sad that, that uh, what's his name? Boss, the si si Sly? Yeah, Sly. Wait, I didn't watch that game. What happened? Oh, it, it, honestly, th these like, last like, few sets have been so close. Oh, yeah, I'm going to have to watch this replay. Like, By the way, casual plug. All of the Twitch stream bods are saved to my YouTube channel. <laughs> so. Can I plug my Twitter here? No. You're going to do well to plug your Twitter. Hello? Fuck you, bro. <laughs> I'm kidding, I'm kidding. Follow uh, 3Q Smash on Twitter. I got the camera profile picture with the Santa Claus hat. I have dog shit takes about everything. I feel like this is like gangsters versus businessmen. <laughs> oh, dude, Day Night followed. I totally didn't see that. Let's go. Yo, yeah, Sal, Day, Day Night's first time was on the tournament, and he did pretty good. Yo, Sal, what's good? You gotta hey, come? Did he go 2-2? Two two? How do you do? You oh, I'll go check. You gotta come next week. I have a new meeting. Also, this game has started, and we are too busy talking about the social vlogs, and so far it's pretty even. Um, that said, a game is never even against Kazuya. This character is pretty broken. That said, Inkling is definitely a character who uh, can exploit Kazuya's weakness to combo. And, Yo, I almost got timed uh, out game one. Actually, I almost got timed out game one. I got timed out? They went to a minute left, yeah. Were you playing Ka uh, Byleth? Yeah, I was playing with the slogans um, Inkling. Oh, that was a yeah, really good confirm. Got the 69.6. Yeah, Day Night went 2 2. Nice, Let's nice. go. I went 2 0. Oh. Sorry, 0 oh 2. <laughs> My Ma bad, 0 oh 2. Mars hates you. That's what happens when you don't sleep. Mars hates me, dude, yeah. Pog. I'm, gonna, I'm gonna go whine on Twitter about how Mars is an asshole now. I mean, he is an asshole. Fuck Mars. The only ZSS player I like is Sal. Sal's a cool guy. Blessed. Hey, no, we got Captain Peru. Captain Peru, Captain yeah. Peru here yeah, too. yeah, yeah, yeah. Those are the only ZSS players I like. Sal and Captain Peru, they're homies. Dude, Captain, yeah, Captain Peru is total homie. I'm talking really fucking fast today. I don't know why. Dude, you're hopped up on all this tea. Yeah, there's so much caffeine in that tea. Yeah, and green tea. Really? There's like, there's like none. none. <laughs> well, I had I had a double bag for Earl Grey earlier. Ah, uh, uh, you're old. Yeah, you're beat out of your mind, dude. And that was a really good bomb, and that board is going to take it. Arif is up two stocks. This is a huge deficit for uh, Kazu to make up. That said, uh, one Inkling is at kill percent. One Ego. And Just one Ego. Kazu does have some very dangerous zero deaths. But he is not getting anything right now. Yeah. He is inked. Dude, he's cool. This shade of Kazuya looks super cursed. <laughs> yeah, that up smash gonna miss. Dude, he matches the stage background. Look, look at, look at the color you. of the ink and the like color of uh, the bottom of the stage there. Nice little twin piston and dash tag. Twin version. piston dash oh, tag. That, that's the move. That's the move. It's called twin piston. Let's uh, go. We Arif. got we got our boy Sal rooting for his homie Arif. Don't blame him. He's been cooking stuff up tonight. What did he do? He cannot get money this week. He's he, not top he four. Did. Oh, I guess he got paid. I think he basically gets top four. Wait, did he lose? No, they're in losers finals right now. So yeah. Bro, just doing a one hundred dollar money match. Sorry, no losers semis, losers semis. Bro, no. Yo, Sal, do you want to do a one hundred dollar money match? I'm joking. I'm joking. I'm joking. <laughs> you still have to do your money match against a bird. Don't okay, you? that. I'm not really doing any money matches until that happens because I'm gonna be making side bets on that first. <laughs> oh, I can't play Bioless. By the way, we are not condoning gambling here. I am. I don't give a fuck. I'm joking. I'm joking. I'm joking. For legal reasons, that was a joke. And okay. Yeah, okay, that okay, was yeah, a pretty yeah. dominant game by Arif. Oh, oh yeah. Hard for Kazuya did against Inkling. Bro, if you don't like Genshin dailies, <laughs> you're doing your Genshin. Just casually do them on stream. No. <laughs> Bro. So, um, Sal, I know you're a huge Metroid fan. Um, 
I didn't sleep last night because I was playing Metroid Dread. This fucker played straight up all night playing it. I literally, from 10 p.m. till noon, the next day, I played Metroid Dread. A little bit based, though. A little bit based. That's what Franklin's done, call, man. Okay, game two. And going to a small battlefield. Um, what, they were on. Um, Hollow Bastion in game one. Those Hollow good. Bastion. That, yeah, they definitely felt like a more dominant stage for Inkling because stage control is way more important on that stage. That's a good ass stage. The center platform. I don't know. I don't know if good stage for Inkling because I know nothing I mean, about characters. I feel like a reef banned uh, FD. Yeah, yeah. And oh. this makes sense to in go to Kazuya. Uh, Inkling more so wants to just base everything, where Kazuya wants to just get in there. Yeah. And the force in there, so playing on a smaller stage is going to help him a lot. Yeah. One person misses, okay. Oh, roller. Rage drive. Uh, he's not gonna die. He does have rage drive. That was really but good. Fair. Oh, shit. Oh, that's that a neutral special to stall? Gambling is cool and epic. Thank you. 40. Yeah, Bella always does 40. That's the meme. <laughs> is yeah, that did 40? Yeah, it's supposed to do 40. In fact, I think the 40% is the weaker version. <laughs> yeah, rage drive is kind of strong. Kind of strong. Still Dude, oh, he sniped the bomb. Let's go. Back here. He He's not dead can... yet, and that said, Inkling has to try and get some sort of kill because otherwise, Kazuya is going to destroy him with all his rage. Yeah, one EGAF could lead into some nasty conversions. <laughs> yeah. I don't know. EGAF might just kill in a bad spot right now. 10 out of 10 game on Metroid Dread. Yeah, that's a good ass game. I didn't play it still, though. Oh, Wait, that dude, that almost killed at like 60. That off smash was a nasty little angle there. Oh, oh he gets gimped by the. No, he's it back fine. Back. Probably just because he's broken. Okay, back air finally takes it. Nice capture, Good yes. We Yo, we got Alamir in the chat? Let's go, let's go. What's good? Okay. Yep, yep. <laughs> that takes it, yeah. Start KO. Uh, Arif was pretty dominant game one. Oh, I didn't update it. Oh, I'm. I'm I'm actually inting right now as his commentator. <laughs> Don't mind me. This, this is losers finals, by the way, so it's best of five. I oh, was just inkling on PS2 and Smashville. I don't know why. Are you playing with moving platform Smashville or vanilla Smashville or lame ass Smashville? I should say. Uh, but if it's fighting yeah, there. Dead. I just lose to inkling. Bit of a society moment. Oh, we're seeing a lot of back airs. This is like very safe pressure, and that ink is. That was so bro, weird. That I was can't so get over weird. how weird Kazuya looks with all the green on him. Yeah, very safe ledge pressure here with that bomb follow up. Okay. Okay. Get some hits. Up. Oh, oh, he gets okay. the Nair kill. With the even game. The spike on Nair. Dude, yeah, this is an even game. Kazuya can make a huge comeback right now with all his okay. rage. Like I always say, one electric. He's got rage drive, okay. and he's dead. Never mind. <laughs> nice. Good good finish there from Arif. Bit of society moment. Um, same vans. Yep. 2-0 for Arif. I'm updating the score like a good commentator. For how much did you say this T was? This shit's really good. Uh, you don't want to know. <sighs> I'll have to get it on, like, discount. <laughs> Even then. <sighs> Even then, it's not more expensive than every other team. Okay, running like it back. <laughs> running it back. <laughs> running it back, same matchup, yeah. Hazard's off, yeah. That makes sense. Okay, up throw. Fair. Bomb. Oh, that was a really good bomb catch. I like that. Okay, Inkling, that's going to be extra damage with ink on him. This is a lot of unconventional percent right now. Almost 100. Okay, he has a rage drive though. I say one electric So win. that could be 340% and, oh, he catches the tech option. And that's a zero to death. Monica, that yeah. was a really clean stock. If someone, if, if you have any Arif fans in play that chat, you want to clip that. I would so we not got be Sal. Sal is the Arif fan. I'm a fan of Arif. I'm a fan of everyone here. <laughs> Hello? What? I'm going off on how salty were they lost him earlier. <laughs> I wasn't salty. I played my best, and he played well. Hello? Yep. Okay, oh, we got some big percent from Kazuya here. Sh shields a roll this time, not gonna get sauced by that. Oh, trying to catch the tech with that bucket, but just barely too late. And smart. That down, he's gonna send him off stage. Side 
That said, Inkling has a very good recovery in this matchup. Uh, not much Kha'Zix can really do to contest it. Doesn't get the Burry as the tech option. Yeah. That's, oh, I think Kha'Zix is trying to save his Rage Drive here. Mm -hmm. but oh, he tries to go for the one uh, tilt. I think it's the Tombstone something. I don't remember. Dude, all his move names are kind of like just insanely badass for no reason. He loses Rage Drive, yep. Dude, it's Kazuya Mishima. Kazuya Mishima. If it wasn't badass, it'd be a disservice to the character. I, was that the electric? No, that was an up smash. That was an up smash? Yeah. His up smash and his uh, electric look very similar. The lightning's uh, blue on the up smash. Ah, uh, I see, I see. And that Baxter's gonna take it. This is a very dominant game for Marif once again. That's a Florida there. Oh, that that uh, neutral special looks like it would hit more than it does, but the uh, hitbox on it's kind of small. Uh, Up the out of shield gonna take that. that was a very very. Actually, that was not a shield. That was a whiff. He whiffed uh, dash attack there. Yeah. Yeah, gets some ink. Gets a back throw. I really like these B reverse bombs. They look super clean. Very good at controlling that base. Okay, no JB three. Okay, is he gonna use this rage drive? This rage drive could be huge if he has something. Oh, he gets it! Okay, that's a Lost free 40% up to his 59. Oh, line killer, just barely not there. Okay. Oh, we did get a clip. Let's Ooh. go, Sal. Ooh. Okay. No, he died. And oh, yeah. he goes too low. Unfortunate. Yo, we got a sick clip. That's it. Three on a handshake from a. So that's a, yeah. That is a three on a handshake. Good vibes all around. Casio players know they're broken, but also know they deserve to get destroyed sometimes. So, total bit of a homeboy. Yeah. Kind of a homeboy, and we are going on to grand finals. This fucking grand. Who do we have? We have. Yeah. <laughs> So, Bromentos was actually just playing a money match. I don't know actually how it went. I'm gonna grab my tea. We have uh, the myth, the legend, Sla Sly, who loves to money match people. He was actually shit talking how he wants to rematch uh, the one, the only Sal again to a money match. Be rush for the fans? Hell yeah. And they are ready to go for grands. Uh, Arif is on the loser's side. So he will have to reset bracket. start out with Cloud Inkling, yeah, no real character kind of thing going on right now. There we go. Yeah, back on how is that game? Ah. Also, what do you think of this matchup? Uh, for uh, this? Immediate limit charge. We are playing neutral as Cloud here. Yep. Thanks. I mean, Inkling kind of the sortie killer, but I feel like Cloud has such big disjoints and there's such a kill power differential in this matchup that it might not matter. I will say, I also feel like Inkling has really good gimps against Cloud, though. It's true, that's true. Offstage is definitely where Cloud, as usual, is, uh, is going to suffer in this matchup. Yeah. The most. And what do you think of Romento's run to loser to the Grand Finals? Honestly? He, I mean, he hasn't uh, he hasn't dropped the set yet. It's pretty good. Reef, and, uh, well, Reef, yeah, also. Reef losing in, uh, in first round and going to Grand. I mean, he's just... Lose to in first round? Uh, I think he lost to Sly. I think he lost to the Ices. Oh yeah, that's right. That was yep. a huge upset because uh, Sly was seated very low because we weren't he hadn't been around for a while. So uh, hey, I'll be I'll be honest. Shout out to uh, Sly and Day Knight. They both came here and uh, 
I almost lost a first round today night too. Like it was, it was. Yeah, uh, these guys, were, those guys are cracked. They've been practicing clearly. Yeah, but uh. The, the homeboys. Arif, hey, Arif has been playing out of his mind today. I'll tell you, I just got well, rocked by him three games in a row. He's yeah, playing very well. Thanks to our lovely viewer Sal, that he's doing so well. I know they <laughs> train together a lot, and Sal is so pretty cracked him on. he's here. Oh yeah. So Sal's gonna get that kill, recharge his ink real quick, very clean, catches the ledge with that down smash. Let's see here. And I mean, green cloud. Yeah. Dude, nothing is funnier to me than seeing characters get turned colors by Inkling. This one, like, something about that neon green in particular is Dude, just, it just uh, looks so nice. It looks like he's on the Nickelodeon channel. Yeah. But let's see here. So, I mean, the thing about... Oh, Nair? Yeah, grab. Ooh, Nair. never oh, mind, Nair never mind. I'll, sh I'll just shut up. I'll shut up. I'll and just oh, shut up. I him, too. It took his jump. I was going to say, the thing about this matchup is if, if Cloud Yo. strings a couple hits together, he can really get that stock out, even at 78. So. Reef is here to win. He is not here to mess around. Hey, he's got a long way to go, but the way he's playing today, I can definitely see it. Let's back see. Air. Yeah, not getting hit by this roller is going to be huge, though. He yeah. He's stage to come back here. Ooh, just a little off on the neutral get-up timing with the forward okay, air, but... Okay, limit. This limit could be huge right now. It almost feels... It almost feels like a bit of a waste to use limit on this, yeah. yeah. It's just you feel like Inkling should be dying Honestly, a little earlier. Honestly, the thing is, though, Black limit so fast in this game that it doesn't really matter true. most of the time. It's true. Okay, yeah, trying to cover that. It's really hard to gimp that up uh, special oh, really yeah. uh, fast. But still, even just throwing out those attempts, you know, keeps him honest and makes him uh, have yeah. to wor wor worry about varying up his timing. And, and okay, that's not going to kill. It's a lot of damage, I know that but... that does kill eventually, but not from cross stage like that. Mm-hmm. This is... I mean, it's getting a little out of hand. And okay, that's going to take stock one. But still, this so is a much huge to come back, Although he does have limit on the come up. It's true. Okay, and again, limit. I'm going to keep saying it, and every time I say it, it feels like uh, Bermentos gets uh, carried off stage. But Cloud can make these comebacks just because of that kill power differential. So I can really get Inkling out of here at a surprisingly early percent. Now, I don't know too, too much about Bermentos' run, but I feel like he's dodged a lot of uh, matchups where Cloud gets gimped easily. Um, I know he played like Diddy Dank. Uh, earlier in bracket, and uh, I know Kazuya also, as you played, don't really have good offseason matchups versus Cloud. No, it's not. Uh, it's not the same kind of uh, like Diddy Dank plays a Pikachu, for example. It's not anywhere near as bad as what could be done to Cloud offstage in that matchup. So, Inkling, oh, did, did he play Cloud against? Uh, he played Bowser against uh, Cloud, but, but not Pikachu. Yeah. Yeah. If he has, his, he's more comfortable in the Pika and the Bowser, so it makes sense. But yeah, on paper, that Pikachu matchup feels like hell for Cloud. Well, I think part of it is that uh, Diddy Dank is really familiar with sword matchups, so it makes sense that he played Bowser into a matchup he's familiar with. Fair enough. But regardless, uh, back onto this match. I mean, yeah. you want to say Bermentos has made up a little bit of this lead, but he's still just looking very we've dire. Seen, we've seen a Reef Ooh, and that very good against oh, chip damage. Yeah, it might actually just be it. it. Yeah. Yep. He didn't have limit. Went too low from that. Yeah, I mean, solid two stock by Reef. Uh, the first of at least six games, but he's well on his way oh, to no, reset. Could be at least five, bracket. right? Or, okay, including he has that, to win. No, yeah. sorry, he has to win six. That's right. right. Yes, correct. Like if, if even if he gets double three O's, we're looking at six games here. So yeah, it depends. Arif might be keeping us here for a while the way he's playing. Oh, well, that or it could be a quick six games, you know. Oh, I see. I got. I see. I got clipped there. That's unfortunate. I did get Bro, zero to, to death. To be fair. Hey, hey. This is a sick clip. I, I can't. I can't complain about it. It just you know it hurts to be Bro, on the receiving. If you play heavies, you have to pop off for your own clip as much as other Thank people's. You. You know? Do you want to hold on to this, and then I just, like, don't pay next week or something? <laughs> is, that, is that cool? Uh, the classic get third place goes back in the pod for next week. Yeah, I mean, I'm only going to spend it on this anyway. What a legend. All right, so going into game two here, we're on battlefield now. Interesting. I guess I'm not sure how uh, Inkling likes those triplats. They might not be the best for her, but... No, Inkling loves these triplats. That's what, see, that's what I would think. So, but I, this is also male Inkling, not her Inkling. Oh, yeah, true. Yeah, right. See, I'm so used to Inkling, girl. Privilege, bro. Yeah, I apologize. Don't mean to, to misgender any Inklings, but I'm always just so used to uh, people playing the Inkling girl that I mean, realistically, me they're, they're, are they kids or squids is a real question. And does that affect... Well, you know what? We won't have to get into this, but... I was just thinking, there must be some rationale here to uh, to Bermentos picking this triplot. What do you think uh, that would be? It's probably up the up the uh, shield's really good with those platform extensions. Fair. Uh, it's also a lot harder to punish if he whiffs. Um, it also gives him some space that he can shark underneath those platforms. Uh, Fair. Inkling was like abusing a lot of landing space, and if he can use those platforms to take away some of that, then that makes sense to go to Battlefield. Battlefield is also for a lot of people a comfort pick. If they don't like have a stage they like in the matchup, they'll go to something they get comfortable with. That's and fair. Everyone's like, played really on Battlefield hundreds of times. Yeah. Oh yeah. 
Is playing on the Especially couch if you've with ever your boys. Played online. Not that I recommend playing online Smash, but um, definitely agree that uh, a lot of people who have played online find comfort in Battlefield. Yep. So, not starting off nearly as poorly for Bermentos oh, this time, kills. but. That was maybe sus DI, but he's also trying to hold out his space that back here, so it makes sense. Yep, there I go with the curse once again. But still, even even with this in mind, still this game this a lot more yeah, in control than the more first even. one. Seems some good adaptation with his uh, counter pick here. We can, oh, uh, up air, yeah, or up smash, line. hitting the back, but weak hit, not quite enough to do anything. That said, Cloud is about to eat up. Oh, he finally gets up smash on his shield. Okay. Yeah, so we're even up, basically. Too comfortable hitting shield there. Well, actually, well, we're not so even anymore. 50, 65. He's now, uh... uh I, well, okay, he wastes limit, but yeah. Cloud could have gotten a big percent combo. Oh, absolutely. But. I'd say Cloud doesn't have a lot of, like, crazy combos. He more so is, like, a neutral monster. He's a... Oh, he's a. Uh, I think I think we got some uh, yelling going in the background about a money match. Perhaps. Oh, he doesn't get the board smash. But yeah, so I mean, Cloud's Cloud's a neutral monster. He mostly like two hit combos, if anything. Okay. Things like fair side B. Uh, I can't it's, believe he punished Limit Cloud. Uh, cross slash. Yeah, I mean, it was just more so calling out the uh, movement option from Bermentos afterwards. But yeah, well, that roller. I think it was because he did it mid air. He fell out and back in. Yeah. Cross slash, yeah. But, uh, I think so. Part of the reason he was able to punish that uh, cross slash is because he was in the air when he did it. Yep. And so he had landing leg as opposed to just like uh, on the ground leg. Mm -hmm. uh, and so then he was able to punish that plus his uh, defensive option. Of course, but then once uh, the roller hits, it's that roller is so difficult to get out of. So oh, that yeah. sealed up that stock. And now we're looking at what could be a game two Ooh. here coming out real quick for a reason. This is a very green cloud. It's a very green cloud taking. I believe it's 1.5 times extra damage when you're fully inked. Uh, it's ri something ridiculous. It's a honestly. big number. It's uh, it's too much, but. In ink oh, Arif is running out of ink right now, so he's gotta try and find a solution to this. On the bright side, uh, Bermentos is running out of life, so. <laughs> Arif <laughs> is. Uh, to give, yeah. yeah, Arif, Arif, you know. He, uh, it's, oh, I was gonna say Wait, it's a nice uh, problem to have. He tried to but bomb and he was out of ink and he did the taunt instead. That cloud up smash out of shield just it does everything for pays your taxes. I will say I was like Inkling's, Reunites your family. Uh, Inkling's uh, no ink bomb animation is probably one of the most BM non taunt moves in the game. True. It's like uh, Diddy's uh, when he goes to the banana bee as an apple. Yeah exactly. Just shrugs his shoulders. It's great. Shrugs his shield. But anyway, we're in a pretty deadly ledge trap situation here, probably for Cloud. Oh, we're hearing some serious mashing over there. Let's see. Oh, back throw might do it. Yeah. Yeah, it's gonna take it. So, game two, going to a reef once more. That was a lot more even, but not quite true. It for Bermentos. If that pattern continues, uh, Bermentos definitely looking good to take the next game, but... Bermentos does have a lot of games to adapt to. Arif is going 6-0. Uh, we got Arif is going 6-0. That's a prediction. I don't know if there's side bets going on here, but... <laughs> I think that's fine. As yeah, long as... Uh, against yourself, that's called rigid uh, matches. Yeah, as long as, as, long as you don't... <laughs> yeah, exactly. But um, on a reef. two bucks on a reef. We got a two million on a reef here. <laughs> on a reef going 6-0. Chris, uh, I got a new horse now. Wait, wait. we got Captain Peru in the background here, no. betting against his training partner, yeah. Bromentos. Oh Just no God. loyalty. It'd it be, it be your own boys, you know? You can't trust anyone on these streets. Dude, he's here to make a buck, and that's it. Apparently so, but so life is hard when you go 0-2. You know, just unnecessary shots there, but uh, going. <laughs> I, 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 I'm talking for myself, bro. I went over <laughs> But uh, anyways, I mean, this bet's not looking too bad so far with the reef up 2-0, well on his way to a bracket reset, and starting this game off in the lead, but it's uh, it's very close so far. Nothing's so gotten too out of hand. So he has a lead right now, but Cloud has limit now, so this Cloud could change things around. All we need is uh, a quick finishing touch. Uh, There's a lot of respect and a lot of spacing going on here. Mm -hmm. You can see the way they're jouncing around each other. Oh, doesn't get the you the booha combo. Uh, yeah. So this oh that that'll Back be a bit of a booyah though, though, but booyah. Not quite killing out, of course. Still okay. pretty early in percent, even Back off that top to platform. To cross slash. Oh, dude, that ink stuffing out cloud is so funny. It's yeah, it's, it's definitely very difficult to approach uh, against. You can, if you can go over it, perhaps you can punish, but it it's such a good way to control space. Really weirdly. Yeah. Well, just so many little hitboxes, right? Oh, he can't punish the multi jab on shield. He needs to get back 
in center stage here. This is not a great place to be against Inkling. Can exploit you so badly off stage. Also but got the mythical percent on deck, and is this that's result? gonna do it. Oh, no, dude, that up smash hit. is the, the scooper hit didn't do enough damage. Yeah, up smash is surprisingly uh, weak on Inkling. I'm always surprised it doesn't kill nearly as early as I think it would. But I think if he had gotten the stronger hit and the scoop had like hit properly, I think he would have killed him there. Perhaps. Regardless, you can kill him pretty quickly here anyway. Cloud definitely doesn't like this uh, position against Inkling. And that forward area is going to take yeah. it. Keeping the god percent on Inkling here. Okay, uh, I guess the back hit is hitting. Memento's there. ruining everyone's fun, but that's fine. Gets his own ledge trap situation, but okay. doesn't quite convert off of it. Doesn't get much off oh, that throw. Well, he's, he's not really quite off the ledge yet. Options. Ah, there you go. He's back center stage. And what's the nuke? This is good. Yeah, okay. That was it. This is good. Here. They, they neither. They were just swinging at each other and missing for a while there. Just great uh, avoidance oh, from each player. Did he double grab ledge there? I don't think he saw. All right. Oh, the oh, air's out of that. combo, okay. yep. Yeah, Cloud he makes it up. He needs to get the stock off soon before Inkling gets much more percent because this is going to be a hard deficit to get back from. Yeah, I mean, there's always... Oh, the clank uh, on the forward face there. All right. So, 61, 73, Cash lots tag. of extra credit. Uh -huh. That's the thing about that ink, man. Okay, I guess inking. It might not help killing, but oh, that, Ooh. That doesn't take it. and he does have limits, so he definitely makes it back. That move is easy to di because you're kept in uh, the grounds for so long. But that said, it's still important Ooh. to make sure you die properly. And okay. Oh, unfortunate SD from a reef. Hey, still 115% up though, so this game is still very yeah, much in control. But oh, keeps his limit, gets back to stage. That may have opened the door for Mementos to start making okay, this comeback, one. especially with limit and that Just sharking under the platform. Shield there. Let's see here. Yeah. Oh, he clanks with the bomb? That's so silly. Okay, oh, okay. Yeah, dodge oh, roller. That's, that's going to be I huge. I think the ink actually slowed him down there and made it so he couldn't catch up to him. Oh, he jumps in the And that'll bomb. do it. That's Cloud does not make it back from those. But, hey, he's got one more stock left. Got to get this stock off soon, and then he can uh, okay, hopefully get some limit shenanigans on the last one. Oh, but a restart in the pile on that extra credit. Yeah, I've seen back there getting out space here. Yeah, you know, it's okay. always uh, oh. it's always in your head that hey, you, you do still get another best of three even if this uh, goes to the worst. But you know, you, you hate to have that uh, momentum against you as the winning side player oh, going yeah. into it. Ooh, misses yeah. the blade being gets shielded, but it can also be mentally exhausting to keep playing against this for another three games, right? Yeah. All right. Ooh. Oh, oh wow! He punishes the roll as he runs out of ink. Okay, this is his opportunity to make a comeback. He's got very stock doable. Even. He's got, got limit. limit. Deck. Ooh. Oh, going for he the soul rolls out. That was really smart from the reef. Not letting his shield get broken. 121. This is a big deficit to make back, especially when you're oh, off stage. Dead? Is cloud against Inkling, yeah, and that'll do dead. it. Yeah. Okay. Well, it's a bracket reset. It's a bracket reset. We got at least three more games still coming up, but a reef looking great so far. If you guys need a breather, take a breather. You got to hold on this side to go. And Bermento gets sent to losers. Yeah, definitely. Uh, speaking of breathers, Bermento is definitely needing to probably take just a quick mental reset, figure out what went wrong there because, I mean, he's definitely got it in him, but it's just you have to adapt. Arif kind of had his number. Arif is a really good um, long game player. Yeah. So. Matchup Assault. Matchup Assault? Matchup Assault. 10-0. It's a 10-0 matchup. It's, it's the only plus five in the game. Inkling the Sorty Killer. It's we worse than Bile DK. We all knew it, but definitely looking solved there. Reef making the matchup look solved. Taking those three games fairly comfortably. Last one was a bit close, but always had uh, a solid lead there when he closed the game out. So if you... If you're Bermentos here, do you think? Uh, oh, we're gonna watch the Twitch clip. Oh, uh, don't watch, m don't watch the, the clip on me. I'm so sad. Was it on you? Yeah, it was just. Uh, I mean, it, it, it's it's just a bunch of neutral ones in a row. He oh. just uh, he just kind of kicked my ass. Let's see here. Uh, a reef fucking clip me. Yeah, yeah. He zero got a zero to death on me. Back here, boom. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Gets oh, catches that. Bomb. Bomb. Ooh, ooh, ooh. A little bit of paint. Yeah, yeah. into the grab. Ah, uh, it baits out that down air. All right, we, I think we got the next game starting up here. The zero death, I think, is almost over. Oh, your range dry half face and... Arif, indeed, schmoving. Oh, We're watching yeah, him schmoove all over me yeah, right there. Really and there you go. Just, a, just, just 
Just, I mean, just out, just yeah. Thirty seconds is very playing solid great. Pressure. All right, going back in here, we've got yeah. So thirty-eight percent on cloud already. Hollow Bastion. Okay, evening percent up. Come on, baby, let's get a dubski. Let's get the dubski. Let's get a dubski. Uh. Okay, these affairs are really good for sharking that middle platform. Someone's gonna get a dubski, that's for sure. One of these players will definitely win the set. Uh, we'll see. Oh, good blade beam. Okay. Who this person is uh, oh, voting is he for dead? here? No, no. Ooh, guess the bag. I think they just want somebody to win. Period. Maybe they just want someone to win. If they want someone to win, they I will think, definitely not be disappointed. As the commentator uh, and PO, I'm excited to go home. Well, uh, <laughs> I mean, this is the no the, the no sleep weekly. This is the no sleep weekly. Well, he tries to char I think he was trying to charge limit there, get the up B before he got to the blast zone. Virtually doesn't quite get limit in time, and I forgot that. Was couldn't score. make it in time. Yeah, go. I mean, if you wanted to go home earlier, you should have been uh, you should have been given your spear bomb energy to Brementos earlier on. But now, we're st <laughs> it's, it's one set regardless. You know, like we're we're in here for a set, no matter which way you look at it. Bro, I don't have any. Are we in here for bombs. a set or are we in here for a training room sesh? Because the reef is kind of making him look like. Hey, hey, if you want to talk trash, mm -hmm. hey, like. Yeah, he's 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 kind of steamrolling him a little bit. I, I don't uh, want to be that guy, but it, it is a little one-sided. You know, like if you weren't if you weren't Bermento's, uh, you know, training partner, I'd be a little bit sus of what you're going on about here right now. Just saying. It is uh, it is definitely it's just like the way Reef's playing today. It's just very difficult to get in on him. He's using a lot of he's using a lot of safe aerials, spaced aerials, and neutral, just making it a chore like that uh, ink jet. Just making it a chore to approach him. Great use of all of Inkling's tools to kind of oh yeah no. frustrate the opponent for sure. Arif looking like one of the scariest players today. I mean, he took out Diddy Dank as well mm -hmm. as uh, our very own Brick. Like Arif has definitely been on a tear today, and he's not stopping so far. But Nor again, is he I feel like every time I've said this, I've just cursed Brementos further. But again, Cloud does have it in the kit to make these comebacks. Stop saying it. <laughs> it is. It's a hundred, and so he can get this stock off pretty quickly with the uh, back air and up smash, or yeah, even an F tilt. Yeah. And uh, now we only got it's and a it's a, it's a one stock in the lead. Yeah. Chilling. Dude, dive into the heart, Sora, our boy. Who do you think oh, Sora okay. is? Finally beats out the roller for once. That is true. Okay, yeah, you gotta, I think, it, it, it's much easier said than done, but I feel like so, you have to kind of put on a little bit more pressure. Just make a reef a little bit more worried about using these tools in neutral, because right now he's just doing whatever he wants and it's working. Um, I don't think he's doing whatever he wants. He's like very careful, very surgical almost. No, absolutely. The way he's uh, darting in and out, getting those ink on him. Not to say he's throwing out random options, but it just seems like he's just winning neutral significantly more often right now. Well, the other part of it is also, uh, Arif is getting a lot more often of punish games. Disrespectful from the commentators or the apology? <laughs> Disrespectful to who? If you're talking about uh, Captain Peru uh, yelling at Bermentos there, that's, uh, you do not, his, his opinions do not represent the opinions of McMaster Smash and, uh, You know, they've got well, a we were all bit, thinking they've it. got this, like, love-hate rivalry going on, okay, like, it's really cute, but it does get old, so. Speaking of getting old, I think this, uh, ledge situation is definitely getting old for Bermentos right now, but he makes it back. Oh, I, I, and once again, the curse yeah, really in action. It's just Cloud it's, is now above 100%, so he has way less yeah, action. Yeah, and he's not he's making it back. back. It feels like it's so difficult for Cloud in that situation, just getting it's off the ledge against Inkling. Splatbomb has been blowing this matchup apart. Like, yeah. absolutely Dude, Splatbomb is ruining Cloud's so much offstage game. Today. We've seen a lot of Splatbomb destruction. Splatbomb is a modern art masterpiece. I think if you're if you're Bermentos here, you Splat just have to... Splatbomb is more interesting than some characters in this game. <laughs> like Lucas? Hello? <laughs> That character is sauce as hell. Just fist fighting here on the commentary booth. But, uh. I'm just trying to. I'm just trying to. Is that what I'm here? Oh, is baby. If you want a money back. If you, if you want a money back. Do we need 0 and 2 Thug Finals? We might be looking at an 0 2 uh, Thug Finals. I don't believe you want this smoke. Schmuck. I'm 0 and 2, ready to go 0 and 2. Oh, bringing out the Byleth. I was oh, wondering. I, you know, I didn't want to say it. I asked him about the Byleth, and he shook his head. I mean, he said he wasn't going to do it. But, but I mean, hey, you know, mix up. So when you're going through hell, keep going. So the issue with Cloud is he doesn't actually get a lot off of neutral, like, neutral wins. Uh, and we've seen that like, really struggle this matchup. And so Byleth kind of makes sense because he can get a lot more damage with straight hits. Hey, fair enough. Yeah, if you're, you're going to be winning neutral uh, less than the other guy, you might as well get more off it, right? So... Let's see how well, this battle yeah. works out. If, it's more like you win neutral more when you do win. Because like, he enough. has been able to get some chip damage in, but it just hasn't been enough to like get a stock off, right? So you may as well go with a uh, more kill option type of character. Mm -hmm. And Bileth definitely with those tippers oh on God, the F smash, on really the forward, forward air, back air, everything. Just He can definitely, if I, was talking, uh, if I was saying Cloud had kill power differential in this matchup, this this is a kill power differential. And Plus, like, a lot Cloud, harder to gimp off, uh, a lot harder to gimp off stage than Cloud. The other that part tether. is that, so Cloud's out of shield options are like very safe, 
but don't get a lot of like percent, right? Yeah, you don't have a lot of no real follow up after upbeat. Right, whereas Violet's Out of Shield options right. are way more dangerous. Yeah, that Nair is going to be... And then you Ooh. get hit by a lot more. Yeah, see, I think... Oh, maybe not, actually. Oh, I was gonna, see, yeah. I was going to say, yeah, uh, Violet makes it back in situations the Cloud doesn't, but that is not one Violet's, of them. So Violet's problem with the Trap Breeze doesn't have great air drift, but other than that, his up B is insane. Crazy. Longest it will, tether it will in the game. snap, like, anywhere. That up air? Ooh. And you can even use it to wall jump, which is just absurd for a tether. Obviously, like, the wall jump situation is kind of niche, but when you do, it looks so sick. MK Leo makes this character look godly. All right, let's really see good here. From Aaron Not quite that. killing on the side B yet, yeah. But Byleth got some solid ledge trap game. Barely oh, mistimes the down smash oh, there. The weird iframes on roll there just to avoid that. Doesn't take any shield damage. Feathers that back right is away. Extremely dangerous. Here, hit your shield. Not wasting any time. Oh, he missed that damage. The down air on shield there. That could have done a lot of shield damage too. There's definitely been a couple missed opportunities here. Oh, in neutral, we are we are seeing some inkling gaming, dashing back and forth, abusing the low profile. Tries for the Nair stage swipe there, the but upbeat. yeah, doesn't quite get it. Oh, and gets off. Okay. No, does not get Trying off the ledge quite yet. There you go. The state off the ledge options. Nice forward air just to just to get yourself uh, some air to breathe there. But now, for situation reversed. Inkling back to center stage, and that, that does not kill. Yeah, will not the spikes there. will not kill there, but uh, Ooh, oh. the back throw back throw will oh, not right. do it. I yet, didn't think I was gonna take it. Bileth does make it back from these oh, at least, uh, except for the right stage away, good okay. yeah. Really good uh, force attack situation there. Yeah, I mean, at this point, Arif just playing incredibly, right? Like, they're not not uh, not oh, too much he you can say. He just stands there as he whips his back air to punish. Hey, listen, there's there's still, at the very least, uh, this this game uh, again. Listen, I, I've, I've said it for the this, I'm gonna say it again, but even more so, Bileth. This game's not over. Uh, Bileth can definitely make these. No, I, th I think this game is over. Hey, you never know, man. If, as long as long as you got to stop. I think this one in particular. You got to stop. One percent. You got a well, chance. Okay, you still got data for game three to gather. That's true. If nothing yeah. else, it's data. But you got to stop. You got a chance. This I think it's just. Uh, though. I've this never seen an inkling this than, long. Uh, he was looking at his cloud. So. Yeah, it's a, you know that is that is one uh, one hole in my kill power argument here. Still doesn't kill. Bylus. Ah, uh, he just the low profile. He literally just charged underneath the arrow. Bylus does have a uh, mild version of Marthritis, where if he just if he's not scoring. If he's not scoring those powerful oh, tippers, then it makes it really hard God, for him to close out stocks. Stage and and insane. That's going to be a three stock, leading us into potentially the final game of the set. Hear me out, Piranha Plant time. Dash, dash dance, flushed emoji, indeed. Captain Peru uh, calling for the Piranha Plant. Uh, Romento's a secret, secret, secret main. We'll see where he goes. We'll see if he sticks with the Bylus, goes back to the clouds, uh, pulls out the Piranha Plant, or what else, but. We might see the the Mario, the Joker, the Wolf. Uh, he's in he's in dire straits right now. Yeah. So, so we need pick, to see something. You might pick random. We need to see something from Romento. Try to learn as much about the match as you can because you never know. This might end up happening again next week. Ah, they just gentlemen to temple. I don't know if the commentator saw that. They did just they gentlemen did, to temple. Did we? We you know this is called we're getting and, and some, it's Prono Play cult? versus DK. <laughs> or it was. Yep. Ah. Uh, <laughs> Go out in style. This Let's is the go. this is the biggest gentleman I've seen in a long this time. This is grand finals, by the way, folks. Yeah. This is potentially our last game here. Temple. With an eight-minute timer, well, this is probably going to be relevant, honestly. They heard uh, Jortson oh, say he wanted to go home, and they figured platoon. they figured they'd extend the set out a little bit here. Ah, yes. Really wanting to, to keep Jortson here as long as they can. Make your TOs upset with you. It's a great strat. Well. Yep, they'll seed you well at the next tournament. That's how that works. Oh my god. Oh my god is correct. Oh we god, we do have uh, a gentleman to temple and then a DK piranha plant. This and they're fighting the in the most, pit. That's hella culture. This is some of the most scrappy, brain dead heavy stuff I have seen in a hot minute. And Bra this is this we've seen Incineroar Bowser matches in grand finals recently, so yep. Brain Dead, this is so this is these are these are men of culture. Dude, they're just no, they're just no, tech no. tech checking each other against this the is, ceiling. This is literally tech training right now. Yeah. That oh. down smash takes it. Well, I mean, Bramentos, this is working out for him so far. The counter pick of his dream. This is a brilliant counter pick. Yeah. I'm not even gonna lie. Dude, Plank can get back from anywhere. He doesn't give like he doesn't care how big the stage is. Oh, but oh. the cargo throw might no, no mash is out of it. insane. And the Plank makes it back from those mashing skills. Even with the buffered air dodge. That, those Mario Party skills are relevant for something. Bramentos might be playing the long game here. Oh, that is a lot of damage. And he lives. If he wins this game, this is uh, <laughs> he does okay. oh, totally he does not win. <laughs> okay, good. <laughs> if Rementos wins this game, this is one hell of an ice. 
Could you imagine if this is the game now, that opens this, up like this his set game, win? So if, imagine Brementos win this, right? Yeah. What do you think Arif counterpicks this situation? Uh, uh, probably un <laughs> great cave offensive. Well, like, they have uh, to. They have to gentlemen, right? So. I don't know. Like, oh no, not the SD. We might. Oh my God, he gets the spike. We might Arif not. We might not figure Arif out. Arif what saving him from the SD Arif by is saving slamming the him into the blast zone. Gentleman counterpick is. He doesn't want people to know, because they will be scared. Oh. Okay. We think this is a gentleman counterpick, but this is probably just what Arif means <laughs> in his free time. <laughs> yeah, this is what him and Sal do for training, right? They just uh, Donkey uh, Kong yeah. dittos on Temple. Yep. Underneath the stage. Hazards on, by the way. Not that it matters. And that. Not, and this yeah, DK, kill DK does not make it back from those. Very but. silly situation here. Now, Romento's on his tournament stock. 50%. 69, the god percent, but... Oh, dude, plant? Wait, he's been blessed. He has to win the Oh, set. 70. Oh, oh. Dude, the Arif, does 1% exactly. Arif knew how dangerous that situation was, taking him off the god percent, but... Dude, oh, we're seeing some... Uh, that was a solid spot punch. dodge. We're seeing some slant camping here with these... Uh, uh, oh, Patuis does not buffer them. the air dodge, makes it back. Is this it? Oh, ding dong. Is this a reef taking the whole oh, thing? Are we, going, are we going up the top? Are we going up to the cap? No, he takes oh. his time getting back down so he can charge. Real man fight in the pit, but. He's going to take his time getting back down to the pit. Doesn't want to get sharked. Oh, I was Arif worried about that no giant fist. But... He's camping in the Salty Spadoon. Salty Spadoon, yeah. <laughs> How tough are you? Oh, hey, he's kind of getting camped out right now, but. 80% on DK. Quick back air or oh, anything dude, from DK. We'll, we'll seal this if it goes special. the right way. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. So he's, he's, he's not letting him back in the pit. Rementos might blow this whole thing open with this game. Oh, we'll have to see. Will he get on the board? Untackable. Oh in his own God. grand finals. He keeps getting the tech. Arif just ping ponging them right the now. And the doggy punch is still that alive. That might not and do he, it. That, he's, yeah, bouncing, he's, he's bouncing everywhere. That was like four untackables in a row, We tech those. That's how strong we that was. We tech those. Dude, these techs. Oh, and the parry. Uh oh, uh oh. These two players teching for their lives. Both 200%. Tech! Oh, insane tech. Oh, that yeah. might do it. No! <laughs> the bounce! <laughs> the bounce goes the wrong oh, way. Oh, there it is! He didn't even hit the ceiling! Oh my god! <laughs> Arif earning that win in right style. You know what? That was 100% deserved. Wow. That is a way to go out. Bramento's going out like a man in that one. Arif playing, uh, even in that DK set, man, playing absolutely great. Just he went 9-0 in, yeah. in, the, in, in the past sets he played there. So. Insane. But he just went 24 Arif, out of 24. Anything you want to say to the people? Yeah, come, come, come here, man. The biggest simp, Sal. All right, so first ever tournament win here. The secret, just Congrats. look at the title of the tournament, No Sleep. Oh. Uh, That's the secret to win. All right. For all you uh, aspiring Smash pros out there, just don't sleep before your tournament. Do not be well rested, and you will don't play sleep. as well as Arif did. Have a midterm. Eat something that makes you sick. Yeah. Hey, this is the formula. This is round one. Lose your first. Yeah. This, think of you know. I'll just go home and disqualify myself. Decide to stick it out. Yeah. Win. Win your first tournament. Some of you may have heard that the best leader is the reluctant one.